here. We're a little camera's a little low. Max, your camera shifts all the time. Yeah. Yeah. I'll take that as a valid criticism. I gotta, I gotta, I'll take I'll take that as a valid criticism. Alright, alright, nah, 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 nah. Alright. Alright, let's see. Here you go. Alright, so. Down, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, in. Up, down, in. Down. I really just need to learn to wait a second. Up, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up. Swing, swoosh, swing. Alright, I'd say that means we are good to go. So, let us begin. Today's going to be a little bit awkward because, um... I were me and my fiance are going house shopping and we might have a deal on a house so I have to keep my phone on <laughs> in order to um, keep an ear out if I need to like sign some documents or something but let us begin hello my name is Max also known as Electro welcome back welcome back to the sewers I hate the sewers I gen I genuinely do not I don't like this place <laughs> I don't like it at all, and it's incredibly winding. Well, okay, so the reason I don't like it is because, for whatever reason, last time I played, I just got really flustered. I got really flustered, and a uh, pee pee poo poo man killed me twice. Once because I forgot the hands were there. And, um. So I'm just kind of taking it out on this place in general. But it's more so that the layout, like right now it seems totally well and fine and good, but later it gets very windy. And it's our goal to figure out oh, our way down. Huh. Lesson learned. Yeah, we gotta find a way down. We also, as you can see on our compass, we died earlier, which is part of the re- Oh! I spared your life, you're welcome. I'm sparing your life as well. I'm not sparing your life. Because- Oh wait, I should've got the, um... I should've got- I should've turned on the spell. I should've turned on the spell that makes it so I can cure myself. That was an unfortunate error. It's okay though. Hmm. Already though. Already though, I'm seeing items on the ground, which would suggest that I have not been. Haven't I been here? Haven't I? Oh, God, and since it's enclosed, since it's enclosed, hi, buddy. Oh, shit. I was going to say, I thought that would kill you instantly. I remembered it, I remembered it killing you instantly. So these guys are a bit beefier. Are you friendly? Hi. Woo! Well, I just thought I would ask. Ah. Alright. Yeah, since I don't quite remember. Since I don't quite remember where I am or how I got here. Uh, this, is, this is gonna be interesting. Hopefully, we can clear it fast, though. All I know is that I would like to get my money back, but that isn't necessarily a requirement. Nope. Yeah, that's the big thing. That the ju that my jump attack and my unsheath both stun him. And they're not the best against bleed either, which is a blessing. 
but they hit like trucks. That's the scary thing. They all hit really hard. Now here's the question. Is that the hole I go for? I don't know. Or you could just go off of... Hey! That was rude as shit, mister. That was rude as shit. <laughs> so I just hit flailing and running by, and I'm just like, just very, very polite. The most polite sidestep, just like, pardon me. Alright, um, I don't remember my range is, alright. It's been, a, as you can see, it's been a little bit. Oh, hey! Oh, and, uh... Whoa. No. <gasps> ah, that was treacherous. All right. We definitely don't want to get stuck back down there. A, because I don't remember how to get out of back down there. And B, down there is two pro are two prawns, if I remember correctly. And prawns, for whatever reason, are just flipping nightmares. They're just really strong for no good reason. Now, maybe it's just a matter of like, well, Max, what you don't realize is they have shit. I, I don't know, whatever defense, right? Maybe their physical is awesome, but their special. But their special is really weak. I don't know. I've just been having a real hard time with them. There's some bugs down here, if I remember right. My money is generally this direction. Oh. Jump. Jump. Ah, that'd be funny. Oh, shit. Could have hurt me there. Oh. What do you mean? What do you mean dead end? I didn't think I... Dude, I got Smithing Stone 8. What do you mean dead end? This is awesome. So good. Well, okay, now I know it's a dead end, but still, it's, it's great. Love it. Happy to be a part of it. Yeah, bug ahead, but that's solely for normal healing, which I mean, might be useful, but just not quite what I'm needing. This whole place is a dead end. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know about you guys, but my mental map. My mental map is not doing so hot. No joy ahead. Like, I don't know. Just places like this. Well, it, it's like if it was an open air, it's so much easier to build a mental map. But since, you know, it isn't, this feels right. Oh, if I fell off there, I would have been heartbroken. Good shit. All right. I started choking on something for no good reason. Hi, mister. Okay. Sorry, just like right. Sorry, get a tickle in my throat. Made me do a little bit of a panic of just like no, 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 no. <laughs> just start retching. All right. So, so these are the pipes. These are the pipes that I was running around earlier. If I had to bet. Asshole. Damn it. You see that little guy? I'm gonna throw three back! Sh shit. <gasps> Fuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuuu
I should note they're not particularly they're not particularly weak to um who do we call it? They're not particularly weak to lightning, which is unfortunate. Uh, the imps. I don't. I don't remember if they have a specific weakness, but we'll try fire just for sake of trying it. But hopefully now, hopefully we should be able to figure out our way a little bit better. Because okay, so we went. We don't need to go that way. Just drop down. Most of these guys we simply don't need to kill. Just go this way. Go this way. You're innocent. It's that plant. That plant is notably not innocent. Now I know I know the correct path to go is the other way, okay? I, I want everyone to know I recognize this. But the last time I saw a path like this was by Pee Pee Poo Poo Man. So I can't help but wonder if there's anything back there. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Yeah, what are you gonna do, asshole? Yeah, I missed. Oh shit. Shit. Oh, this is dastardly. This is dastardly. I can't move forward or else I get poisoned. And they smoke me out. That's smart. Oh, no, no, poison still. No, okay, there. I, yeah, that's right. You never expected what I just punched the shit out of you. Okay, there. Fire's completely gone, and then I need to throw it. Yep. Oh, shit. I was about to say, like, watch out for the slam. And then he slammed. Okay. And... Nope. He's not, he's not out yet. Okay. Poison stone. Like I said, this is probably not the way we actually want to go. Whoa! Shit. Shit. That almost got me. I killed him using skill. You're welcome. Nomad ashes. What? Oh, wait, wait. Nah, I'm, I'm willing to bet that'll kill me. Um, what are nomad ashes? And it's too narrow, so it's a barely man as he's a fallen, able to emit the terrible flame frenzy from his eyes, but it's low HP and is frail, and able to take much in the way of punishment. Cool. Um, okay, yeah, so I was right. It, this is just a quick prize. Worth it. Are we ever going to use it? No, but... Burp, sorry. But still cool. Also, in just, like, looking at Red End stuff, apparently Tish is low-key one of the greatest spirits. <laughs> There's this, there was this post I saw on Reddit that was basically, like, um, just a bunch of memes of, like, spirits that carry, like, carry you through the game kind of a thing. And, um, Tish was one of them to the point where, um, yeah, I made it a point not to watch any videos on it, but apparently a good amount of people will just flat out, hold on. Apparently there's a bunch of bosses where if you just summon Tish, you can just kind of watch, and Tish will kill the boss for you. Or, like, it's pretty likely Tish can kill the boss for you. Which, on one side, is, like... Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. Which, on one side, is kind of funny, and on the other side, is, like, well... Yeah, I'm, I'm still gonna split. I'm happy spirits are a thing. Spirits have definitely saved my ass. Uh, save my ass on notable on um, or no no that's wrong verbiage. That's the wrong verbiage, my ass. Numerous spirits have definitely saved my ass on numerous occasions. But that doesn't mean I want to rely on them. You know what I mean? 
Ah. That was bad timing. Ooh, good, good, good. Yep. Nope. And you're out. Now I think... Remind me, did I... I went up that way to get to the next spot. So I don't know if I went this way. It feels like the, the way I went is the way I'm supposed to go, just with how much of it there was, you know what I mean? But if I go this way, maybe I'll see a shortcut. Or in general, learn something. Maybe this place isn't as confusing as I thought it was. I was just thrown off. Holy shit. Well, that already, that already made it better. And there's my money. There's my money right there. Oh, come on, come on. Ah, that would have been great. I bet that's where I need to go. But my money is down there. But I also just got the hooch McCallit, so here's what we're going to do, ladies and gentlemen. I missed. All right. Okay, now we just need to secure the area. This should be... See, don't, don't forget the greatsword ones are so... That's okay. That's okay. Because, because we could just jump right down. All we have to do is secure the area enough to teleport out. And then we can just keep our money and go on our way. So I feel, God, I feel way better about this situation. This is ass. Life is great. All right, uh, I'm just gonna throw this because I can. Okay, so the lightning bolt. The lightning bolt, which keep in mind is powered up. The lightning bolt, which keep in mind is powered up. Actually, it does about the same. It does about the same. All right, well, let's ask another question. Which do you like more aesthetically? Oh, lightning bolt, 100%. Lightning is like my favorite element. Just for fun factor. Whoa! Okay. But I got my money. Yep. Go, 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 go. All right, you're out. Big boy with a sword. Okay. Uh, I got his head. Cool. All right, and now we see if we can just... Perfect. Kept our money. Is there a way to uh, get back up? Probably. Is it worth it? Probably not. Let's just stop and be honest with ourselves. Uh, I have nowhere enough to level up, right? Yeah, yeah, I don't, I don't have enough to level up at all. My jump attack is, I forgot my jump attack was more effective now. Um, was there something I was thinking? That's right, I was, okay, hold on, let's. I forget, was there any, was, okay, there was this. That's right, we were using the Bloodhound step, which I adored, but also, like, I I adored this, but it felt kind of cheap. Uh, Sacred, which, Sacred's what I got now, so if I did this, um, it's about the same between Sacred and Fire, which is noteworthy. And then, uh, poison, coal, the coal, keen. Oh, sorry, it's heavy. Why is heavy? Okay, okay. Yeah, keen. Okay. Oh, because my strength ain't all that bad. Okay, so keen would make it so it is 370, which something I need to remember about keen. Okay, so, because I look at this and I'm like, 370? Well, my, my current thing has 500. So that's 130 less power. Yeah, but you can apply shit to make up for it. I 
and maybe that shit would I uh, if I could look at exactly how much if I could look at exactly how much it added like numer like number wise you know maybe I could play with it a little bit but I don't know. that's the one that's just a spell right yeah so great uh, it's about the same hmm. so basically I get a ranged attack but I do a little less damage as lightning um ooh, that's what I got right now I do okay hold on coat the blade in to unleash a rending blood slash in a white arc see the, the the joke here the joke here is if I do this so I would lose two-fifths of my power because our power is about 500 right now so this would drop us to 300 but I could have poison yeah right now we have 45 blood it would lower it a little bit but negligible and we would get 90 poison or I could just get it uh, my friend my friend Jeremy my friend Jeremy was saying like it's actually pretty worth it especially if you're doing a bleed build Fuck it. Like I said, we're here to have fun. Um, I am going to get rid of. That's right. I was trying these and not about it. Okay, so let's let's get rid of that and replace it with and replace it with the flame cleanse me, and then we'll get rid of these two. Keep in mind, we don't need every slot filled, especially if we're not going to use it and we're just going to get caught on it. And then from here, I'll do this one. Blood loss of a city increases attack power. Yep, okay, so hold on. It's just one slash. Okay. So, bleed build. Let's go. Bleed build! Notably, these things don't bleed, but that's because they're rocks, so that makes logical sense. Can I jump to that? Is there a point to jumping to that? Probably not. Other than my own sick entertainment. I mean, there's a dude here. But he does... This looks like... This looks more... Yeah, this is more of a hanging position for... Oh! Ow. Yes. Let's not lose our money here. A little bit short. Ooh. That wasn't bad. Alright, we're gonna have to... Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna have to teleport out or else we're gonna throw it around. Homeward bone. Say, there we go. Just like, homeward bone, take me home to the place where I belong. Okay, so that was like 800 power? Which I don't remember how much the drop was, but it could be about the same. Um, the drop didn't kill him in one hit, but that did. I'm gonna hold on to this for at least a little bit. Oh, no, that one didn't. And it doesn't cost that much to do it. So that makes me pretty happy. Alright, let's just stand here for a little bit. Be wary of up. Yeah. Hey. That wasn't very nice, mister. I wonder. I just want to test something. Interesting. Yeah, look at that. We are brothers. Oops. We are brothers in the bleed. Try down. Well, looks like there's only one way, so. Let me talk. Oh shit, I'm almost dead. A little bit of a risk. Better than the alternative. 
Wow. Okay, I might not be able to jump up there, so hopefully I'll... Oh. Wow. It's kind of fun. I haven't got a... Oh. I haven't got a bleed on any of them yet. That's okay. Like I said, these guys are made of stone. They probably have insane... Oh, so that leads us to... Wait a second, so I've been here. Damn it, that means I've been here. So what have I... Shit! What have I gained then? This just gets me an easy way to get back to. Hmm. Well, I went all the way that way then. I guess we're just gonna follow this mouse who's totally leading us into an ambush. And just judging by that there's money here, turn back then seek north. Well, I gotta, I gotta look. Oh shit. All right, so that's two. <gasps> Why ain't this a pisser? Only takes two hits, and you can see I'm already powered up. Are they fight? Uh, I was gonna say I don't think they're fighting. Okay, so now I can just kind of. Nope. Ass. Shit. That was almost death. <gasps> he can climb up ladders! Holy shit! Oh god, Spectre Man can climb up the ladder! Bye. Bye. See you pull that one off, asshole. Smash cut to him, like, coming down the chimney like he's freaking Santa. Alright, so... There's a hole. <laughs> Alright, alright, alright. Surprisingly easy to miss. Uh, likely hidden path. Well, it's not, but I appreciate your optimism. Ah, oh, there's a treasure down there. Uh, of course. Interesting. Wait. What? What? <gasps> Boss head, therefore seek ahead. Ooh. So if it's not this way, it must be down this hole that has a treasure, which is the game's way of encouraging. I want Tesla real quick. Sometimes when I hit bodies, they still bleed. Oh shit. I just, I, without even thinking, I did that with the intent of doing the, uh, sheath slash. Like, just, you know, without really thinking about it. And then it's just like, oh yeah, I'm not, I'm not doing that. The power increase, I wanna, I wanna look that up. I wanna Google that, like, okay, Lord, Lord of Blood's Exaltation. Okay, so Elden... Ring, Lord of Blood's Exaltation. Which I imagine when people get this thing, they're like, oh my goodness, this thing's the best. I don't remember where I got it. Esker, Priest of Blood. Okay. Increases attack power by 20% for 20 seconds when a nearby player enemy is inflicted with blood loss. This stacks with the white mask. It also affects the power of spells. Using Seppuku on oneself will also grant this bonus. Yeah. Yeah, it looked like Samurai, Sanguine Samurai, Venerous Bloodblade, anything that involves blood or causing bleed, I imagine, adores. Magwindas. What the fuck? God, we really do got a ways to go in this game, which is great because I love this. Alright, let's go. Let's go mess up that boss.
Oh, shit. Um, um, it's not full screen. Why is it not? I broke it. Uh, full screen, please. Thank you. All right. Let's go. Let's do this. Let's do this shit. Well done. Yeah, for lucky. Well, I guess that one commoner is like the shortcut, but I don't remember how to get to him, so. Let's just one and done this shit, shall we? Alright. Probably a little bit of a waste, but I'm just gonna do it to do it. Hello, Fran? You're not Fran. Oh! <laughs> That's it, you're all getting it. I forgot how tanky you guys can get. Jeez, that attack, it must be like the drop and that it just punches through defense. Okay, notably, no one's been hit by bleed yet. Okay, he's gonna spin. Kinda hoping to curve it. There you go. Jeez, ah, living jar shard. Time for champion. Yep. Ritual pot. Nice. Okay. Get a feel I'm gonna want flame cleanse me ready to go. Yes! Thank goodness of grace. Thank goodness. Yeah, like, I kinda wanna. Well, I mean, drop has that, the, the drop attack has that quality of, like, it seems to just ignore defense. Or, like, resistances, or however you want to say it. So, I find that really interesting. Oh, this is dramatic. This is really dramatic. I don't know if there's a need to, but it feels cool. Mog the Omen. Hey, big guy. Listen, we can talk about this, right? <laughs> Alright, noted. Uh, what did he just hit? Okay. Ooh. Whoa. Shit. Ah. What is with you, like, really horned dudes? And having strikes that are so insanely delayed. Alright, let's go. Ah. Thought I'd get away with some shit. That's right, big boy. Nope. Oh, it's like a shower. It's gross. Alright, I'm just gonna take this. Alright, let's go. Damn. Ooh. Ah, didn't think that would hit me. Ooh, okay, you gotta pull. Noted. That's probably forward. Yep. Good follow up. That was good. I'm willing to throw out a bet. Okay, this new this new bleed build is fun, but I'm gonna throw out a bet. He has so much resistance to bleed. I mean, his whole thing is fire and bleed, so I think it's safe to say neither of them shits are gonna work. So let's just get rid of that. Nah, it'd be funny. You wanna do it solely for... I have one goal in this fight, it's to land this on him. That's it. That is my only goal. I just want to see if I can land that on him. This happens in every stream. That, like, I just start doing shit for funsies. <laughs> it's, it's like, cause what? What's the worst that happens? I die? I'm gonna die already. <laughs> pick, pick one, pick one. <laughs> Alright, first things first, we're gonna need our money. Shit. 
shit, I didn't get it. Wait, did I get it? Oh, I did get it. Nice. Okay, that did that didn't actually do that much. I was kind of hoping it would like rapidly apply free the Nope. There we go. Nope, nope, no, no, no. Nope. All right. God, you just destroyed your little church. Ooh. Nope. Yeah, see that? It it see I was hoping it like each tick would count as a full hit to apply freeze. And I get the feeling it doesn't. So yeah, big toothy face and one of your horns is going in your eye, you poor thing. That happens to goats. When they can't, you know. Well, and their horns aren't sheared properly, so, or, you know, break, broken off, or... Alright, um... Uh... I'm gonna go back to this. Just because I can. Alright, uh, I said... I said, uh, lightning and... No, lightning doesn't do anywhere near as much damage. Because, simply put, I... Lightning is based more on dexterity than faith, while my faith is really good, so... You also don't move that much. I want to point out. So let's use I bet both of these are going to be really solid against you. I'm one short for that spell. Once again, we're here to have a good time. So yeah, my bet here is that I'm going to have plenty of time to crap these spells on him. That's not the right word. To slap these spells on him. There you go. And um, he's not that mobile. I'm probably like putting way too much effort into this, but I'm having fun, so... Screw it. Oh shit, that mess lasts for a minute. Okay, we're gonna need a minute to... All right, just gonna let him hit that. You wanna throw shit, big guy? Oh my gosh, he, he just used my method. Is that doing anything to him? Wow! That did virtually nothing! You are... God, you are very good at covering for yourself. Oh yeah, big guy? Let's just see what happens when I do this. That's all it did. Hold on. Hold on. In two slashes, in three slashes, I just did more damage than a spell that takes, than two spells. Two separate spells that each take 50 faith. Damn. Alright. We'll get rid of those things. We'll get rid of those spells. We'll never use them again. Let's do this for real seas. Let's do let's let's do this for real seas. I I just I I wanted to I wanted to give it a try. Alright, so memorize spells. So get rid of that, get rid of that. Um what were the other spells we established were actually pretty good? Um Hone Bolt was meh. Uh, Fortax's lightning spear was good, but it basically was like, you, they have to be stunned. 
Um, so... Yeah, let's get that. Um, the Crucible Breath... Okay, hold on. The Crucible Breath is good for groups. It's better than the Tail. I love the Tail, but, like... I love... Okay, the Horns is funny, but it, all, but it doesn't really work. The Tail is great, but... Eh. And then the... Um, these are fun, but I'm not the biggest fan. Um, yeah, because the fire is more for the crowd control, and then we'll just do that, and we'll call it good. All right. Oops. Not what I, not what I meant to do. Okay. Oh, wait. Hold on. What's my... That's right. All right. Totally forgot that I had that. I was too focused on trying to pop off spells. Alright, we'll switch to the lightning spear. So that way if I do throw anything. And... Let's do this for reals. Woof! I love that. I'm sorry. This is so good. Ah! I was hoping I could do that the last second. Woof! Okay, 230, so about one sword slice. Damn. Yep, just like that. My timing was just a little bit off. Damn. Ah, I keep thinking I can... I keep thinking I can go into the Bloodhound. I keep thinking I can go into the Bloodhound to avoid that, and I can't. Ah, I just... Yeah, he's... I'm gonna take that. Oh, shit. I don't know if you saw, I just tried to hit him with my shield. I feel like his movements are not that complicated. I'm just not playing smart. Did not think you could curve that around. Yeah, I'm just not playing smart. Nope. That would have hit me. Okay. Nope, I wanted to do a jump and it didn't work. Okay. Porter, hello. Ah, it's good to have you, man. How's it going? Nope, nope, out. Uh, we still got a little bit of regeneration. Whoop. Ah. I keep mistiming that, and I'm out of juice. So I could just sit here and do this for a little bit, and I'm gonna get hit. Yep. Damn. Every time you see there's some kind of pounding going on. <laughs> oh, like I said, I I never claimed I was good at this game, or good at any of the games. I, I'm dead. Yep. All right. This is not a guy we can bully with spells. 
fl we'll switch back to unsheath and um yeah we'll switch back to unsheath and do this right and proper but uh, uh but yeah how's it going man i just let's see before you got here i just managed to would the double slash be good on him no 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 we have to we have to be quick we have to, we have to be quick so we're gonna switch that to sacred yep nice shirt oh oh Aw, thank you. I'm just happy it works with the green screen. The camera I had before would not let this shirt fly at all, but does for the but does now, so happy about it. No, I totally get that. That being said, see that being said, definitely, yeah. You know, don't don't ruin your don't ruin your day tomorrow on my account. Okay, you have to take care of yourself. But for me, uh, today's been pretty good. We are, if you hear my phone go off, it's because I am waiting to hear back on, oh my goodness, yep. If you hear my phone go off, it's because I'm waiting to hear back every time about a house. That was good. That's good. I'm I'm waiting to hear about uh so I'm waiting to hear about a house that we I might be purchasing. So yeah, really excited about it. We're hoping to um well I mentioned like you know it, it's not a guarantee. We're just putting the paperwork in. The uh, who should we call it? Our lady needs to do a little bit of bidding, and we're willing to bid a little bit. But um yeah, we're. Me and Megan are really hoping to find a place before we get married, just so we don't have to worry about it. Yeah. Thank you. But, um... Yeah, so if it goes off and I, like, have to check it, I promise I'm not trying to be an asshole. It's just like... Oh, if I need a phone call or make a decision right now... You know what I mean? It'll probably be because time is of the essence. There you go. That was greedy. Ah! Nope. Back up. Back up. Back up. Let him... Let him throw his shit. Let him do that. Nope. Nope. Out. Out. There you go. Let him walk out of the shower. Bad timing. There you go. There you go. Get that, you just leave. We can get one lightning bolt in. Roll. It's a little early. Okay, he's probably going to do a slam. Ah, way... Whoop. Let the regeneration heal us. Nice. You're saying things, and I, I want you to know I know you're saying things, so at least I think you are. And I want to read them. I'm just having to focus. Look at him using those pillars to defend himself. What a dick. That's the kind of shit I do. What a dick. I will sit here and play this game, mister. It ain't nothing to me. Shit. I don't think he wants to play that game anymore. That's bad. Perfect. Oh. Patience. Patience. Don't dodge backwards on that. You have to dodge forwards. But there you go. Just walk around him. Don't don't cast a spell. He's gonna slam. That was bad. Beautiful. Okay, we're gonna take a hit. 
but we're okay. We're taking two hits. Beautiful. We're gonna pass. Yep, he's got some heal loop. There you go. You can dodge back if you have good timing. Got it. He's gonna slam. Focus. Bad timing. Bad timing. Now do uh Ah oh, that works. Uh sorry. As you can tell, compared to like how I freak out with um Resident Evil. I think I mentioned it before. Damn it, I did it again. Dark Souls games are much more my happy place. So you can see like how gears are turning a lot better. So yeah, if I if I have to be rude and unfortunately leave the stream so I can make that phone call. Ah, no backstab. Because of course why Max, why why would there be a backstab on him? Alright, don't jump. Yep. If I had jumped, I would have eaten that. No more heals, but that doesn't mean this is impossible in the slightest. It just means now's the time to focus up. It's all about learning. Death. Oh, I lived. Oh, shit. Nope. That was good. Notably, I never got a drop in on him. So if I can identify when to use his, when to get a drop in or two, I'm willing to bet I can beat him this next time. But uh, to catch up, uh, yeah. But otherwise, um, I'd say today is good. My job is my job is a very feast or famine style of job. So like, um, I work as an IT guy, and um. You know, like, either everything's on fire and nothing's going on. For the most part, today, nothing was going on until, like, right at the... Oh. I was gonna say, what the fuck is that? See, for the most part, for me... Ow, I got caught on the bench. Nothing was really going on until right at the end. Basically, what happened was, um... It was getting hot in the warehouse. And someone decided to... To, like to turn off the fans using the circuit box or whatever it's called and um damn and what they didn't realize was one of the things that said heat also was the circuits for the uh routers in the area so they all lost internet and they're like uh what's going on our scanners aren't working this is weird <laughs> And then right when I got there, the director of the area, he's like, ah, he thought of something, tried it, and was like, oh, this is, this is it. We're good, Max. So I was like, ah, great, great. You know, thanks, John. Appreciate it. That was the most exciting thing. That and, um, filling out some paperwork. Damn. Anyone else noticing this guy sounds like a... This guy really sounds like a monkey. Just every now and then you hear the <laughs> Damn. Yeah, I'm gonna start doing that shit to you. As you can see, that plan worked awesome. Whoop. Whoop. Yeah, get pissed with me. Damn, I went right into it. Mm. Yep, moments like shit. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Yeah, the drop. That was bad timing. 
That was just spamming dodge. That's the wrong thing you do. You should never spam dodge. Damn, I, that keeps getting me. Ah. Nope, I'm going to take a hit. Ah. Good, good. Let's see. Okay, let's just check the chat. Max, if you use your summon... If you, Max, if you use your summon, you can beat him for sure. Yeah, I, I know. I, I could just, I could summon a mimic. I could summon Tish. I could summon. Yeah, I felt pretty good about that. I felt pretty good about that run. But um, I really have to watch those delayed strings, and I really have to watch for that downward strike. He hit me with that downward strike, pretty sure like every single time, and I got hurt for it. So have to be really. Oh, there it is. Shit. Have to be really conscientious of that. Con con conscient conscious conscientious of that shit. Ah, I was gonna try to dodge into it. Uh, when did I... Just gonna reset and think about my life. Alright, that's enough resetting and thinking about my life. Like that. He got me with that so much. And I, yep, the trap I keep falling into. Okay, I need to get out. The trap I keep falling into there is thinking that I can roll past him and then he catches me. And I missed, because I'm so clever. Nope. It happened again. It happened again. I keep thinking I can roll. I just need to roll away. I think that's the big I think that's the big thing there. I just need to roll away. I keep thinking in. I'm used to going in. I just need to go out. And then it's identifying his like slashes and working with it. If I die a few more times, just for sake of um, I feel like having an honorable duel with this guy, because something about him strikes me as special, and I don't know what. But um, if we're taking too long on him, I'll summon the mimic, or I'll summon Tish, and um, yeah, just kind of get the fight over with. Okay, I don't want to step in that fire. Ah! Dead. Oop. Just gonna need to back out and heal. We were pretty toasty there. I'm about to take a hit. Okay, just gonna back out. Whoop. 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 Cast a spell. Really? That shit right there. Just get the tip of the blade in, like we're Marth. I got lucky there. Ah. That was just me walking that time. Nope. Ah. I feel good about this guy, though. I feel good about him. You know, there's, there's some bosses that you fight that just feel hopeless, right? This is me. I got... I got a... Whatever powder, game recepts. But um, some bosses feel hopeless. This guy doesn't. This guy like he's rough, but everything makes sense. Uh, 
and I really appreciate that. It'd be different if this guy was just like bullshit and fuck you. But nope, this guy, he makes sense. Ah! Watch for that horizontal. Oh, guess not. Let him think about his life choices. Alright, he's not long enough. So many of his moves, it seems like I could just kind of walk away from, like this. Okay, maybe not. If even if I'm wrong, it feels like I could just walk away from them. Like that. No rapid dodging, just walk. That what I need to dodge through. Hear that sound when he does that? There's like this swing, like when you get a critical. Okay, I need to back out and heal. That's okay. That's okay. There you go. All right, let's go. That is what I've been trying to do, just so I could do that. I've been trying to do that, and I fuck it up. But you know what? I did it. Oh, no. Yeah, when you, when you hear that, it, like, little ding sound. Oh, shit. If you dodge towards his left side, it seems like you can get through. You have to just walk out. Way, way early. Way early, way early. Try again. There you go. There you go. Get that in. Watch for the counter swing. No, no counter swing. Okay. There's the counter swing. There it is. Probably could have gotten a hit in there, but I didn't take it because I thought he was going to punish me for it. I'll take that, that's fine. Neither of us hit each other, it's good. Ah, way too early. Way too early. I'm about to get slapped. Let him drop it. Let him drop it. Nope, that's okay, take the block. It's okay, take the block. Ah! I was in a groove. I was in a good groove there. That felt good. That felt really good. Yeah, also fair warning border. Um, whenever I play these games, I tend to work better when I like talk myself through it. So you will see me very much turn into like an almost motherly role of um, talking myself through it like I'm trying to be supportive. <laughs> I, keep, I keep joking that um, when I play these games, I turn into a motivational speaker. Knock down two pillars. Shit, that was too greedy. So, fair warning. I do still want to do my best to pay attention to chat. It's just in fights like this where you really have to focus. You know, some fights you can... Okay, I'm clearly not doing very well this round. You know, some fights... You can kind of get away with, like, looking over. To be inspirational speeches. Sometimes I need it, but it's all good. Oh! Okay. But, um... You know, obviously, 
I still want to pay attention to chat, but there's just some bosses where you can look away and there's some bosses you can't. This is one I way too early. Embarrassingly early. Okay. Yeah, we're almost down to half potions. Ah! Nice and patient. Damn. That was ballsy. Yep. Yep. Uh, give, give me, give me a few more. Give me a few more, and I'll, I'll summon the mimic. Or, actually, who would work best for this? Between the mimic, the skeletons. Uh, his attacks are wide-reaching enough. I could have Teach do it. Like, okay, I, I want to say for the record, I'm not against people using the spirits. There are so many freaking spirits, it feels like the game's, like, really encouraging you. It's like, yes, you are going to need them. But there are just some fights that I feel like I need to do one-on-one. -on -one. And something in me says this is one of them. Not a good start. Really not a good start. Well, you know, ah, it happens. It happens. It's fine. You know, step on the wrong foot to, you know, start on the wrong foot, all goes downhill, but we didn't lose our money, which is good. I really don't want to lose that money. I recognize like, Oh, if you, you know, if you didn't have to worry about it, you could just probably get a few good hits in. Yeah, but that's like almost a level's worth, and I want at least one more in faith. Perfect. Not going to take a second to do the spell. Nope, you are not. You just straight to the action. Ah! Nope, that's just, that's the shower. Okay. That was risky. Ah! Someday. Some... Fuck you. Ah. God, look at his hand. He's got like one finger that's like a root. It's not even a finger. It's, ooh, it's like a horn, almost. But, um. Need to get those fires down. Need to, need to, need to get those fires down. Okay, it's real close up to him. Cast your spell, cast your spell, cast your spell. Damn it. Ah, just slap that shit right on top of me. Nope. I'm just gonna walk away from him. I right, now, now I'm gonna risk it. Ah! Just not ready for that. Okay, this one I'm gonna want to heal. Gonna let that get in the way. Let it get in the way again. I lost my tr tracking. Damn. Oh, this is fine. This is okay. 
He didn't capitalize off it, so it's fine. Just get that in, roll out. Roll out. Okay, four, oh, smarty. All right, we're gonna have to get closer to him. Do your combo. Okay, he's gonna take a, perfect, totally, okay, that's fine, that's fine. That's out. Just gonna let you. Yeah. Okay. Damn. Okay, we have to go through the fire and the flames a little bit. Yep, we're just gonna have to take this a little bit to the chin. God, that move's got some range. Roll forward into it. Okay, he still hit me, that's okay. Watch the bleed. The bleed is the scary shit. Look how full it is. Damn, we're about to be hit. Oh, that actually didn't hit me. That actually didn't hurt me for that much. I thought that was, I thought that was gonna kill me. Noted. No more barriers. Let's go. We can connect. Damn. Like a family. That's fine. That's fine. Damn. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yep. Let him swing. Let him swing. Me. Well. Yep. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. Your music's great, by the way. Worth it. Don't take anything for granted. Don't take anything for granted. I'm gonna take that, though. Good game, GG Mog. That was very good. I really enjoyed that. Blood Flame Talon, though. Let's take a look at that. Uh, what's it even under? Oh shit, there it is. Ah, that was good. All right, creates Blood Flame lacerations that then explode. Ah, it's an arcane thing. A Blood Oath incantation. Uh, creates blood flame lacerations with a cast which explode in an instant the incantation can be cast repeatedly after dealing the damage blood flame continues to build up an onset of blood loss for a very short time it's a good spell that like that made that fight difficult great treasure chest and then attacking ahead Erd Tree's favor plus one wasn't Erd Tree's favor wasn't Erdtree's favor the one that, um... Attacking ahead. Wasn't Erdtree's favor the one that, um... Yeah. Raises... Wow, that raises a good amount. Nice. Okay, so they said attacking ahead. How would I have known to do that? I only knew to do that because the game told me. Or because people told me. <gasps> oh, it's a person. Ah, oh, God. I was going to say, like, friend? Why do they... Are, they're not impaled. They're holding them. They're all... They're all... Holding back scratchers. Why are they all holding back scratchers? <gasps> Sir! Sir, the back scratcher, explain. 
Ah, okay. Okay, I don't like you. I've just decided that I really don't like you. What the? Jillard, hello. Thank you for telling me about this. L. Thank you. Have fun with the dropper. The dropper? Why do they all... Oh, shit. Did it again. Um, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Let me... Welcome back to the adventures of... The unsheath is the best in the game. Are you the one playing the instrument? Wait a second. The hand. Are these all merchants? Are, are these all the merchants? The merchants had hands. The mer- Oh. Uh, the merchants had... Yep, this is what I was thinking. The mer- What? What? Oh, you're the one playing the instrument. Well, it's a beautiful instrument, so... Listen carefully ahead and then, uh, beautiful. Pathetic sort. Someone up here doesn't like music. Ah, shh. Welcome to the magical world of jumping puzzles. Hence why you said the dropper, I'm guessing. <laughs> yes. Hey, I almost made it. <laughs> ah. Ah, that's a pity. That's a pity. Yeah, how was I supposed to know that this was here? Like, if there is a guy playing the violin... If there's a if there was a guy playing the violin and you like heard him, maybe. He raised his weapon at me. But otherwise, how how <gasps> I never leveled up! Shit, I never leveled up. I got all sorts of money on it, level up. Ass. Damn it. Ah. Blind luck, I guess. I really don't like it when games do that, though. Because you know something unique and cool is going to be back here. Like, like it, it's a given. Something unique and cool will be back here. And it's going to suck. It's gonna. I'm gonna be real mad. Like I, I, I would be mad if I discovered it was something I like really want for my build, and I missed it. You know what I mean? I love the violin though. It's so nice. Alright, well, there's my money, so we're we're good on that front. Oh shit. Mm. Not there. And welcome to the adventures of Maxis tries and tries to keep his runes and dies every time. Yep. Yep. Mm, look at those blood stains showing up. Mm-mm, girl. Oh, 
Damn it. Ah. I almost had that. Yep. Just went a little too far. That's why I was really hoping I could jump back on and nope. That's okay. This is a puzzle after all. And I get that little bit of satisfaction every time. Okay. Uh, uh -huh. Yep, there's my money. Of course, it's not here, so I can't. I'm gonna be. Uh, if I lose my money, I'll be sad, but I'll get it. You know what I mean? Like, shh, I didn't like that. Ooh, oh, mm. oh, okay. Yeah, okay. The lip. It's the. It's about the lip. Remember that. It's about the lip. Okay. okay. This better be something amazing. <gasps> what? That should not have killed... So it just it just must be the programming that like if you hit the floor you're dead. I've fallen from heights greater th than that and lived like uh, mm. <sighs> whatever it is better be freaking amazing. Come on. Come on. Mm. The way you like slither over the wall is so <gasps> awful. Know what I mean? Inescapable frenzy. Didn't expect dung, but well, oh well done. <sighs> Out this fingerprint stone shield. There's a treasure there. Hey. Hey. There's a treasure there. How do you get the... There's a treasure there. How do you... How do you get it? How do you... Precious item ahead. How do you get the... Maybe I need to do something to the environment. Golly, I hope there's a bonfire. I don't want to do that again. Okay. Jumping required ahead. See if this kills me. Okay. Ah, uh, well. Mm. Okay, so first I'm just curious. In this, the fingerprint shield, right? So what's special? Okay, so it's a great shield. Um, part of a tomb of an ancient god. be the very much frenzy sprouted I don't like frenzy frenzy is of the devil and that and that's all sure folks because this is there to start a different ending what do you mean what do you mean uh, 
Seek stars all the more turn back required ahead. Wait, 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 no, 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 hold on, hold on. Don't you dare. Okay, no, 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 hold on, hold on. So, if you take all your clothes off, you get grabbed by the three fingers. By the three finger? Not two fingers. Not two. The. Th okay, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, if I do this, if I do this, is it going to lock me into the frenzy ending? Because I just want to see it. Like, like I, I kind of just want to, like, see it. I, I want to see what the three fingers are. Because, hold on, if they're normally like this, is it going to be like this? Or is it going to be like... Uh, like a little... But, like... Is it going to lock me into that ending? Or can I, like... And then Brandon and What's-Her-Face says she will hunt you down... What? What? Branded and what? Blight? Like, wait, hold on. So if I do this just out of curiosity, I'm fucked? Like, just straight, the game just says fuck you? I mean, I appreciate that the sides were, um, seek stars and turn back, but what? Randy? Wait, no, 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 uh, sorry, Mel Melania? Melania? Or whatever her name is? Will come down here and fuck me up? Uh, Melina? Melina, what the fuck is this place? If you intend to claim the frenzied flame, I don't. I ask that you cease. It is not to be meddled with. I just want to know what it is. It is chaos, devouring life and thought unending. However ruined... This world has become, however mired in torment and despair, life endures. Births continue. There is beauty in that, is there not? If you mm. would become Lord, do not deny this notion. Please, leave the frenzied flame alone. I ask you, please, as one who strives to become a Lord, Deny not the lives like the new births of this world. Okay, this Those is a who would are not fit to be called Lord when the land they preside over is lifeless. See, this this is the moment where I wish I could talk to her. Just to be like Malen Malena. Malen, is this a house text? It is not. Like I, I would I would want to be like Melina. Okay, look, 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 I agree with you, okay? I don't want this sounds like this sounds like the path of fuck it everything dies. But like what is it? What does it mean? What, what? like I I don't want to do this, okay? I'm I'm on board, okay? We're 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 in my turn, your wounds. Let my hand rest. Share them. Thank you. Please, the Lord of Frenzied Flame is no lord at all. When the land oh. they preside over is Alright, I agree with you. Let's get the fuck out and not look back, shall we? Alright, uh, there's something I want to do real quick that I learned about, and it requires us to go here. Oh, it shows what happens when you do the thing? Uh, yeah, let's go, let's, uh, let's all take a quick adventure to the Discord real quick. Cuz... I can't help but be curious. Yeah, yeah, I just, I, you can't, yeah, can you, can you blame me? I mean, okay, general. Okay, so, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. There we go. There we go, so it's nice and big, okay. Thank you, Suaves. <laughs> just very quietly, where the fuck? All right, we're not gonna watch the whole thing. We might skip around a little bit. I'm not, I'm not wanting to pirate his stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah, I can hear his chair. What? 
if he starts talking a lot, since I was kind of hoping this would be just a cutscene and not like him, you know what I mean? Then I'm gonna have to mute it. What the fuck? Uh, he was talking a little bit before. He was just really quiet. Yeah, you can hear him very quietly. See, I still don't even know what the fingers necessarily are. Like, I, I get that they're, like, kind of embodiments of, like, the tree, sort of. But I don't know what they are, necessarily. Okay, good. Oh, so it passes the flame into you. What? Was that... Am I on a Discord call right now? I think that was him. Yeah, that's someone else joining a Discord call in the video. Oh. Nick man. The fact that he is an enemy. Not even. The fact that he is yeah. an enemy. Not even a fucking mini boss, but an enemy that will respawn if I don't kill him, or if I kill him. Yeah, okay, whatever. That's definitely them on some random Discord call for some reason. Not gonna worry about it. Alright, so, cool, yeah, literally, if you do it, you're fucked. There's no discussion, there's no, would you like to think about this? There's no nothing, it's just like, fuck you. You just took the frenzied flame in you, and you didn't even know what it meant. You just did it, what a dick move. You're an asshole. Okay, so, I was told... That I need to check back here, and it looks like nothing's going on here, so we need to go somewhere else. Uh, here. But Max, but yeah, I love it. But Max, why are we going back to Rani's Rise? Well, you see, there's a certain companion here. That I'm gonna see if we can talk to. BRB, it's all good. No. I'm part of that very being. How can you never betray her? No matter what might happen. That's a right. dead assassin. Blight. Oh! <gasps> no, Blight! Blight, let's talk about this, buddy. Let's talk about this. <gasps> That's another assassin dead. Holy shit, how many of these did you kill? Oh, I don't want to kill him. Holy shit. Holy shit. Artorius, motherfucker. He's the wolf and our. He's the wolf and Artorius. Damn. Badass. Bly, no. Damn. He hits hard. He hits hard, he doesn't flinch much. He doesn't seem to have very many tricks, though. You know what I mean? He seems pretty dang straightforward. Oh, that probably would kill me instantly. I got 
lucky there. <gasps> ah, I didn't think of, I didn't think about the pull. Ah. How many assassins did he kill though? What did he like gain? Did he like have to Okay, thinking about um similarities between him and Artorius. What did he have to like embrace shadow and darkness or did he like get stabbed by them and they corrupted him or oh. Bly no Bly you say it No buddy No buddy no I don't wanna kill you Damn Backstab. Damn. Yep, watch for the pull. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I got lucky. I got lucky twice. Missed. Damn. gonna keep doing that to you ah good hit damn I couldn't get out I was trying to roll out but he got me pinned welcome back homeboy had me pinned down I killed her in that night and her Lord that is nice that like more and more loading. Actually, okay, has there been a loading screen that I haven't been to yet? I don't think so. No, I think I've been to most of the loading screens, if not all of them. Buddy. Okay. What, what was with the golden? What was with the invader lied though? I'm just wondering that shit. No, that didn't work. That majorly didn't work. Donk. Okay, come on. Probably could have gotten that in. Good dodge. Probably about to do something cool. <gasps> no, 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 no! I'm still alive, bitch. <laughs> ah, good hit. Yep, barely nicked him. One more and he's probably out. Good, pin you pinned me. You're a good soul, Blyde. To the end. Royal Great Sword. Blyde's armor. Blyde's gauntlets. Blyde's greaves. Oh, I kind of want to wear them. Like, fuck stats. I just kind of... But look at this. One assassin. Two assassin. Three assassins. What a badass. Do you have his face? I don't. And I think I accidentally read a snippet once. You have to go to... There's other rises. You have to like... Is it like you... You have, you have to check out one of them, right? I got his face, but not his armor. Oh. should trade these. No, I'm kidding. Um, somewhere... Okay, I remember we were exploring here... Let's just do a quick check. I remember this place being really creepy. Yeah, I guess here's an almond killer. There's a albanaric. Is this a I think it's a, supposed to be a page. Some poor girl. Visions of good sort. Sol Solus's puppet do not touch. I'm gonna touch it. I'm gonna touch it. And then there's her. 
I kind of want to touch it. Frankly, I just kind of want to kill Solvis. The guy's an asshole. Like, I don't, I don't even know why I keep him alive. He's a dick. He tried to trick me into turning What's-Her-Face into a... Um, I can't look at my map. That usually means there's an enemy nearby. <gasps> oh. It's just, it's just those. Okay, whatever. Oh, I don't got a good way to jump. I gotta go, I gotta go around. Okay, so I'm like rapidly. I never decided to go back to the rise to beat his butt down. Well, I, I learned about it because I just wanted to be like, I was just going through different NPCs I met just to be like, hey, is there something I can do? And, um, oh shit. Someone beat me to it. Sullivus' uh, bell bearing. Preceptor's big hat. Preceptor's long gown. Preceptor's gloves. Preceptor's trousers. But, um, yeah, it was basically... I was just looking up NPCs and I was, I was looking up NPCs and they're like, yeah, go back to the Forlorn Evergall or go, or Forlorn Hounds Evergall or whatever it's called. Everjail. Gall, jail. And then otherwise go to Ranny's Tower. I think they said it was, it's somewhere nearby is Blyde's Helmet. Which is really his face. But really, since what's his what's his face is dead, I'm just gonna snoop, because I can. This guy's a dick anyway. Yeah, Selvis's puppet do not touch. I'm gonna touch all I'm gonna touch all over. I'm just gonna give all sorts of touches. Yeah, well if um I'm don't oh, oh I already got the treasure. Yeah, if I don't immediately see the the helmet. Oh, it's probably it right there. Such a perv. Oh shit! I guess I lived. Ah, I'm already full health. Perfect. What show was I watching that? It was basically someone saying, don't touch anything. And then, like, the moment they're gone, they're just, like, they're just, like, rubbing their finger. Like, they're not even, like, I don't remember what they're touching. I don't remember what the context was. I don't remember anything. All I remember is just them being, oh, shit. Good save, Torrent. Likely out of stamina. Didn't expect wolf. Yeah. Okay. So let's let's do a let's do a bit of looking. Okay. So me 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 me. Where? Oh. Uh, increases mind to the detriment of. That's kind of cool. All right. Um. It's not what we want, but it's cool. There it is. A mass fashion after the head of a black wolf, relic of an assassin who assumed the guise of Rain the Witch's loyal shadow. The like <gasps> Oh That's why he was saying I would never betray them. Someone disguised himself to Oh no. A well worn black armor of the man wolf blade. His pelt serves as a cape protected from cold. Blade was the blade of Ranny, but the cold bothered him. <gasps> Blade was the, Blyde was the blade of Randy, but the cold bothered him anyway. I don't know if that's a joke or that's just high cold resistance. I'm sad though that um, it's okay. It, it obviously it weighs a lot less, right? But yeah, its defenses are way down. But damn, if I don't look good. How cool would it be that if I like put on this right now? I uh, look uh, uh looks so good though. Damn. I right, I'm, I'm not as I'm not as much if we're doing fashion souls. 
I'm not as much of a fan of the head part, but... Oh, even that looks... That looks sick. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> um... Eh, I like it better when, like, the... When, like, the... The Hoojma call it. Um... I like it better when the scarf wraps around the top. I get why it isn't, though, but I like it better. Uh, all right, the Great Helm's winning. That just looks sick. All right, um, any other armor? Oh, yeah, I got this. Was That oh, raises your endurance a little bit. Oh, cool. Creepy. Um, no, no, no. Okay, so, yeah, I would want, I want this, which... It's a shame, because... What's my... Let's see. Or remember in Bill's head when they went to England with that armor? The Templar armor. Unfortunately, though... Okay, so this is... This looks great. I want that stated. It looks really good. But... I'm, like... The only disadvantage this armor has... Is its weight. Like... It doesn't look bad. I'd say it still looks pretty good. Ah, <sighs> they're all dead. I'm gonna go talk to someone. Yeah, you know, it looks dope. Don't get me wrong. It's. You think my current armor is blah? I think. I think my current. I think the banished knight. Ban I think banished knight armor looks very nice. I'll have you know. Dude, Rani ascended to the stars. Blight and Sullivus are dead. Greetings, my fellow. Unthinkable. How could Blight? No. How did he break free from his cell? He, had, he was in a cell? More importantly, Blight became a curse that plagued Lady Rani. Yet even in madness, gave himself to her. No. I made a grave misjudgment. And I thought myself a capable war counselor. I'll mm -hmm. catch up with you soon enough, Blythe. When I do, I only hope you'll accept my apology. He's dead. Eh, that's nice, man. Anyways, can I buy some shit from you real quick? <laughs> um... Well, thanks for upgrading my weapon. <gasps> Wait, what? 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 EG! EG! What the fuck? EG! 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 No! Oh, uh, no! Damn it! Why? No! He's got a thing inside of his chest. No! Damn it! Fucking! Why do all my friends die? Helmfash from a crystal looking glass said to have never left war council. EG's head easily broken, weak, and striking attacks borne by those committed to high trees and awards at the adventure of the Great Wheel and Sass Vegas. EG was afraid, terrified of his own treachery. <gasps> no, EG! All my friends are <gasps> Oh my goodness, an assassin tried to kill him! And I think succeeded. Ah, <laughs> damn it! Oh, another assassin! What the fuck? All my friends are. Fuck you, fucking sack piece of shit. God, you killed three of them, though. Once again. Fucking impressive. Ah, uh, man. All my friends are dead. Who do I even have left? I got, uh, what's her name? Not you. Rodrika? Rodrika, are you still my friend? Greetings, are you here to see? 
Uh, sure. Ooh, the ultimate upgrade. Yeah. Um, I killed him. Ah, eh, fine. Oh my goodness. The age is dead. Like, hey, you don't even care. And they're like, who's EG? Like, no, no. In this ash, it reminds me of Why aren't you going to the one room so I can make you a queen? Oh my god. Max, are you, are you gonna make it? You're just like making incoherent sounds at this point. Fuck that guy. That guy's not my friend. All right, burp. Ah, for bell bearing. Here you go. Yeah, ah, for bell bearing. Sure. I don't remember what he had. Ugh. Oh, that's, uh, that's kind of cool. Fires massive cold magic. Ah, oh, that's actually that's actually really nice. Uh, can I purchase? No. Oh. Everything you touch die. Everything. Max, quit making crying sounds. <laughs> Wait, it does? What the fuck? I thought I updated it. Oh, uh, re refresh, refresh the stream. Refresh the stream, then I'll say Elden Ring. <laughs> Damn it, I just put a mark of the ocean. Hold on, click. And it's not full screen. Oh, God. Well, I'm depressed now. Moving on! <laughs> um... That one is a skull, so did we just not beat it? Might as well go, might as well go there real quick. If it's a sage like I'm thinking of, let's real quick look at our weapons. Um... Uh, I need something that does blunt damage, so a mace... Okay, so I've been I've been using the flail to okay effect, but I'm willing to bet if I yeah 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 okay. So obviously we're not like gonna go berserk, but like strength and armament go to the okay. I guess I don't have enough of that. All right, hang on. We're gonna. Dolls to donuts. We're gonna have to fight those crystal bitches, and I hate those crystal bitches. So, let me just grab a mace. And to do that, I'm just gonna I'm gonna need twelve of these, and I I'm gonna need eleven of these, and that should get it far enough. Oh, not not the crystal bitches. Oh, well, never mind them. Well, nah, I'll still do it. I'll still do it for next time we go up against the Crystal Bitches. Because I'm willing to bet we're not going to need very much on that mace to make it more effective. Alright, so strength and armament. Uh, strength and my shield doesn't do anything, right? Okay. Um, yeah, real quick. Does, does strength and my shield actually... It's good. There you go. That alone... Raising it to a plus six. That'll help next time we go up against one. Um, yeah, I made a mark there, so I'm guessing. I'm guessing. Yeah, we'll we'll go there next. I don't know what Seathwater River is, and next we'll explore these mountains. It will eventually up the guard boost. Wait, hold on. Was the okay? So define what the guard boost does for me. Is that like how much someone else recoils back when I slap them kind of a deal? Or just, you know, quick definition. Uh, a light would be good. Uh, he's our resident expert. Because I... Well, I hate this place already. I freaking hate this. 
Skeleman! Get dunked on, Skeleman! Yeah, I hate this. It sucks. Which one of these is a trap? Not this one. Is this a trap? Wow, neither of them are traps. Impressive. Skeleman! This whole place is a trap. All right, come on. Come on. Come on, it's a trap, right? Bitch. Um. Either I am way too high leveled or y'all are super, super weak to holy. I'm willing to bet you're super, super weak to hold. What the fuck are these butterflies for? It's for sleep arrows, Max. I don't give a shit about sleep arrows. Uh, ooh. You're most likely over level. Um, I might upgrade my shield. Fuck it. I might, yeah, I might upgrade my shield. I do like this shield a lot. Goes with my aesthetic. Sup, bitches? Oh yeah. Wait, hold on. This is this is a cave in Altus Plateau, right? How the heck am I over leveled for it? Yeah, this is a cave in Altus Plateau. How the heck am I over leveled for this shit? That's right. I opened that chest just to flex on you a little bit. How the fuck am I over leveled? One of these has to be a trap, right? No way this is just... Attack of death birds. Besides excelling at airborne attacks, this charge attack mimics the vicious swoop of a bird of prey. Well, I gotta play with it. I'm not gonna use it, I just wanna play with it. Wow, that is. I'm a Wolverine looking motherfucker. Yeah, yeah. Wow! That's kind of fun. Wow! Wow! Ooh! Yeah. That's fun. So it's the lowest of that area. Uh, try running and then jumping? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Okay. Come on. What is with all these treasure rooms? Oh, well, sick. There's the boss. Alright. Nope. I'm like, dope. Skeletal mask. Raptor's black feathers. All right, I'll buy it with skeleton mask. Oh, uh, guys, I gotta take a phone call. This is really important. We'll be right back. So, bloop.
So, bad news. We didn't get the house. We got outbid by, um... We got outbid by, like... We got outbid by, oops, by, um, let's say, I think it was going for 200, it was either 245 or, I think it was 255. Yeah, it was like for, for 255 grand, and, um, we got outbid by 10 grand, because we did asking price, and, um, they were not, they did not want to, two bosses? They did not want to, um, humor any counter offers so yeah it's unfortunate but hey it's not the end there will be other houses yep th yep there are always better houses you might find a house you weren't expecting exactly so i'm a bit sad because um yep and megan just responded let's see she said kind of figure that happened darn i seriously love the house i know but we'll find another that's better. There. It's like being encouraging. But, um, yeah, it sucks, but, um, we'll, we'll find something else. Yeah, you know, it's part of the game, right? I said weak foe ahead, therefore try bravery. Necromancer Garrus? Hi, mister! I know how to fight necromancers! Holy shit, that did a lot of damage. Nice pet, though. Um, I can't roll through this, so I'm just gonna have to push you back a little bit. Yeah, those two skeletons did a shit ton of damage. Nope. Oh my goodness, you're still alive. You're still alive. Nope. Family heads? What? Yeah, that guy... That guy hit a little harder than I thought. Well, the more I was in the most uh, we were welding end up catching a welding machine. <laughs> you caught a welding machine on fire? Jeez. Is everyone okay? Look, I'm, I'm not a welder, so I'm not going to pretend to be an expert, but... Okay, good, good, good. That's an impressive accomplishment, is all I'm thinking. <gasps> what?! You piece of shit. You piece of shit. I need to get in the water. This is for EG and Blyd, you piece of shit. There. Shit. Thought I was gonna do just one more strike and that would have been it. Fuck! Ah. Mm. Almost had that. Almost had that. I will just sprint through. Oh, wait. Uh, it would help if I turned the light on now, wouldn't it? Okay, fucking move it, Mr. Skeleton. Max is pissed. Okay, we don't need to worry about all the secret entrances or whatever. Uh, looks like you guys want to worry about it. Huh? 
I offered you a chance to live, or, uh, well, die, but regardless, I gave you a chance to back out. You should have taken it. Yeah, I'm glad everyone's all right. Like, welding fire sounds scary as I'll get out, not gonna lie. Wow, you lived. Yep. And yep. And just fuck you just because. Let's see. Uh, let's see. I walked over the wall and pulled the cord. <laughs> you sound so calm about it. Just like, huh. Flip. Huh. Flip. <laughs> Her like, huh. Pull the plug. Huh. <laughs> It's like in my head, that's what I picture. You just you just going. Ah. I gotta get my money back. It's for blighting EG piece of shit. No free grab. Damn. Ran out of stamina. You wanted me to come closer, so I did. Dodge, dodge, dodge. No, again! I was specifically trying to avoid that shit. Watch for the follow up. This is tricky. I like it though. Like this is a fun change of pace, but Ah, I was hoping to catch a uh, catcher in that. Nope. Yeah! Suck it. Concealing veil. Uh, if this does what I think it's gonna do, is it gonna extend my jump? Or is it gonna extend my invincibility? Conceals wear while crouching away from foes. Wait, hold on. So is this thing only useful in PvP? Uh, I know a way to see him. It's a PvP app. Damn it! That's fun, though. I like it. But, um, it's a shame we can't use it. Uh, I don't know what to really use. Uh, probably just have that as a good default. Uh, raise this holy, raise potency. Uh, Uh, yeah, sure. Right now. Okay. All right, so that one's done. So now, I'd say let's teleport here and work our way south. It does really well. I've used it. And it's surprised how many people have walked right up to me and then passed and not see me. So, like, does it turn you invisible? Invisible or like, how does that work mechanically? I guess is my question. Can't believe I didn't collect this shit. What kind of what kind of thief am I? <gasps> oh, you must have been your master. No, I'm not gonna kill you. I'm I'm not. No, 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 no. 
I'm just gonna steal your master's shit then leave. Like a dick. After a set distance of when you crouch, you're invisible. Oh, shit! Also, that's a cliff. There might not be. Oh, well, no, there's this. There's this Campton Field. I was like, what's up? You hit the alarm! Usually it means something's wrong! Soldiers of the tree. Greetings. It is an honor to serve, brother. I don't know what the fuck that was. Brother in arms. It is an honor to serve. May the tree guide your way. Yes, yes. May the tree guide your way. I'm here to talk to your commanding officer. This is starting to look like a problem. Shit. <laughs> oh, no. Someone shoot lightning. I don't appreciate that. Who would that Fuck shooting lightning. Is it you? Is it you? Is it you, big boy? Nope, I have. Ah. Is it you? Okay, hold on. Whoop. There you go. Then there. It was the alert to not get too close to the edge of the cliff. <laughs> well, it worked, I think. Uh, it's using air with tall grass bushes is pretty damn good. Okay. I am known just to run off cliffs on accident, so you doing that is probably not the worst idea. Just being like, hey, 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 hey. <laughs> and I'll be, I'll just be like, what's wrong? And then I'll fall off and die, because that's what I do. Excuse me, mister. Someone out here was throwing lightning at me, and I don't appreciate that. So I just wanted to talk. Next time there's danger, I'll let you know. <laughs> Next time there's danger that you're too stupid to notice. Seek left. Pulley bow. I don't use bows, but cool. It scares him in jumping off the edge. <laughs> hey. Mister... Whoa, 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 lay, whoa, whoa, whoa. You see the way that guy was walking? He was walking like he was drugged. The heck was that? All right, um, we can probably survive this jump. Perfect. Actually, I want to go back down here because I did see an item. Yep, there it is. All right, now we can explore the this mountain. A little actually Am I in danger now? Okay. Yeah. He just woke up. <laughs> he was walking like this. It was, it was weird. This is where we make our stand, gentlemen. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> This is where we make our stand. Oh. They're not that bad. Uh, ooh. Hi. He's like, my boys, uh, my boys, no doubt, murdered him. And just run up and ruin his day. This church looks important, though. No joy ahead. Despair. Underground. Underground. Oh, nothing wrong. Underground. Oh, let's see. Oh, let's see. Oh, oh, Red Rose, hello. I bring some water. Suppose. Oh, suppose it. Um, uh, basically, if I use a few different programs, I can add more sounds. I know, is that something you guys would like? And if I did, what sounds would you want me to add? 
I know I have a whole bunch for bits, but I don't know. I'm not. That's not me trying to guilt into bits. I'm just. I, mean, I don't know. Maybe I could. I could try that. Download multiple programs that do the same thing. See if I can use that to kind of cheese the system to get you guys more sounds to play with. Gelmer Heroes. <gasps> oh, shit. That beast eye. Yo, dog, that beast eye mad quivering. Is my dexterity 30? I should up my dexterity. Especially since all the spells I've been getting at higher levels have been sucking balls. Ah! Well, here we go. I think <gasps> Asshole. I was just about to say, in before there's a fucking chariot. Mm. Nice. There you go. Sometimes there's a little bit of a delay. Just got back from the ocean. I'm jelly. Uh, no, on the alien stream, someone ran out of the sounds that played by the pixels. Wait, what? Like the sound wasn't working, or you'll you'll have to remind me. I'm I'm blanking. Truth be told. All right. Well, now we know what kind of game this is. So ass. Yep, there he is. Hi. If you guys could just stand there for me, real quick. Bye. Bye, Felicia. Nope. Not gonna lie, I'm happy that you're playing with those sounds, but every now and then it does just scare the shit out of me. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> but Everyone else see that shit? Everyone else see that shit? Good jump. It specifically waited for me. It specifically oh, waited. No. Eh, let's not do that. X Files intro. Yeah, I don't know the I don't know the X Files very well. Sometime, if you guys want, I can like go through all the different sound bites that we have for bits, and we can like, we could um, oh, dolls of donuts. There's something down there. Uh, if you want, we could like elect a few to be moved to free. You know what I mean? Oh shit! I almost died. You bastard! That almost killed me. Name that anime. But um. Yeah, we could like go through some of those and like elect ones. Elect ones that are more fun if they're free. And then I can definitely use that time to like take um You're about a dapper looking gentleman. We could take that opportunity to like What are sound bites you think would be fun for bits? Cause like my favorite is the well, I don't know about favorites, but there's a bunch of ones in there that maybe aren't worth it. You know, maybe aren't good, but I like them. I don't know. Guys waiting for traffic? Man, I... Ah, oh, I wanted to hit him. There you go. Oh, I missed. There you go. You see, kids, if you ever want to get around traffic, just fucking shoot them. Alright, oh. Uh, this is a trap. Ooh. Let's see. The other part is a big pain in the butt. I have a guess. I have to run through that lava, don't I? 
If I had to make a guess, I have to run through that lava. Just knowing how these games tend to work. No? Really? Worse? Uh, it's still funny. I need to watch JoJo again. Fuck you. Alright. Ooh, no. I have made a grave error. Oh, no. Alright, we're good. What? You can't see me. Nope, that is um, Joseph Joe Star from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, Stardust Crusaders. Uh, yeah, mine mine's pretty bad with anime too. Not gonna lie. Like, there's always other shows I wanna watch. Oh my goodness, I lived. Okay, okay. What did I even get? I don't even remember what I just got. It was probably worth it. Was it? No. Fuck you. Fucking chariot piece of shit. Mr. Skeleton, can we like really just talk this out? Oh god, of course it's that again, isn't it? Yep. Oh god, it's a shadow thing. Fucking spider, the spider, the spider, the fucking it's bad. Let's shit! Ass! Lady, let's talk this out. Okay, we talked it out. Well done. Uh, ah! Oh, no! I've heard good things about uh, Mob Psycho 100, though. That, that was made by the same person that, um... That was made by the same person who made the uh, One Punch Man, right? I remember hearing good things about it. Beating to a pulp? Well, I'm gonna beat something to a fucking pulp. Something just died. I don't know what, but. No rump ahead. Oh, gal! That made me feel better. <gasps> oh, shit! Shit! Oh, well, let's check it out. Okay, so, uh, Gelmer Knight. It's worse in every way. Alright, great. It's worse in every way. What about this one? It's worse in every way. Do I just have the... Do I just low-key have, like, the best armor in the game? Is that it? Do I just... Do I just have the best armor now? I'm starting to think I do. It's first season really hyped me up. Okay. That'd be, I don't think I watched the second season of One Punch Man. I need to do that too. And catch up on um. I think we talked about this a little bit before, but I've never been one to like watch anime as it comes out. But I started Spy X Family. Oops. I started Spy X Family, and I immediately loved it. Like it was, it's so cute and wholesome. I just realized camera are you serious the thing took the thing it took a second to stare at me hey listen hey what's up demon slayer is pretty good apparently yeah i um i got about halfway through demon slayer fuck you i got about halfway through demon slayer got distracted and never got back to it Okay, so it's not impossible. It's not impossible. Okay. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh, fuck. And I have to wait for him. Oh, that's not, I'm not gonna make that. The regenerating is helping. 
Bloodhound step. Bloodhound step. That's right. Bloodhound step. Oh, no, I'm not going to make that. I have to wait for him to... I've, I'm going to have to wait for him to run through. Oh, 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 this sucks. This sucks balls. I'm in the spicy I'm in the spicy soup. I don't like spicy soup. I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. I don't even know what I'm trying to make it towards. So I'm not going to make it. No way in fuck am I... Nope. Ah... Or you fall on top of the chariot. And that kills it? Okay. Okay, so we know what we gotta do. We know what we gotta do. Okay, so take the Ashes of War, take this. Get rid of that shit, get that. Slap it on sacred. So now we can do this. Which that bypasses. I don't know if it'll let me phase through the chariot. But, um gonna make it so we can move crazy fast that was satisfying like that Hold on. I want to read what you said about your ma liking Demon Slayer. I need just but a moment. I'm willing to bet I can do that same trick to get through that area too. Let's see. Uh. Chris here's flat on time. She also loved Naruto enough to get a full leg tattoo done up at. Wow. Nice. Oh, shit. Yeah, we just have to find the spot to fall on top of it, which is, which is annoying, but doable. We could kill all these guys to farm for mana, but I'm not going to. Uh, not that way. This way? This way. All right, go, 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 go. Fuck this guy. Are you kidding me? All right. Let's see. I'm right past it. Too late, I committed. I committed. Um, where are my souls? Where are my Where are my souls? You can't do this to me. Where are my souls? My souls are. Look up from where you are right now. Ow! Ah, I see. Ah, that's right. I did see the message. I understand what you mean now. But as you can see... Bloodhound is already helping. I might be able to... Is this high enough? Can I praise the I did it? Is this high enough to to do it? Wait. Oh, good. I was going to say, like, if the game looked at me and said, no, no, you can't open this door, I, I was going to cry. Well, it's pointless to do it now. Well, I don't know. Thank goodness for that. I don't know. I'm spitballing. And you just spitballing. Let's kick this guy's ass. Hey, I know you. 
I know you, motherfucker. Let's go. It worked just like I planned. Yeah, I know your ass. I know your strat. Oh shit, you broke a door. Ow. Damn, you hit hard. Nope, I'm playing it safe. Damn. Damn. This thing, which you guys saw how much damage I just did to it in one swing, is kicking my ass. It's got me in a heal loop. Okay, hey, yippo. Come on. Come on. Damn. Worth it. Look how much damage this thing is doing. Good stuff. It was to get down there without having to step into the lava. Eh. <gasps> Yo, doggy got that blood night <laughs> blood. <laughs> Yo, doggy got that blood out night flow. <laughs> uh, sorry, sorry. I got some death root out of the deal. Nice. I don't know what was dead. Got myself some death root. Okay, so you said there was a second path down here, right? There was a second thing. That was just one of them. So, what... Oh, shit. Um, so what is the other thing? Because, um... There was that first path that had... Lo Wait, no, no, no. Hold on. When I was going down... When I was going down, there was that spot that I, like, went into the... Oops. I like went into the wall. Is it like you just keep going kind of a deal? Do I have enough to level up? I might have enough to level up. No, oh, I need like 12,000 more. I bet I got, I bet I got 12,000 more. Oh yeah, I got, I got. Uh, that, that's like half of the. Okay, that's like the other half. Down, down, down in that burn ring of fire where it burns, burns, burns. The ring of fire. Ring of fire. Alright, this is gonna sound weird. I know that song from Rush Limbaugh. Because it he had like a parody of it. That's how I know that song. It was making fun of Al Gore for global warming. <laughs> So I know, like, I, I, I know the original, I, you know, I understand the original of the Ring of Fire. But that's what I always think of, I think of Rush Limbaugh. May rest in peace. Hi, 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 if you could just... Wanna see a cool trick? That was the trick. Alright. Yeah, let's play it safe. Can I make it to the next thing? Wrong way. Would you also like to see a trick, good sir? That was the trick. All right. Yeah, so I kept... Yeah, I went... This way. So if I go back now... Let's see what we can find. Right, go, 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 go. I went too far. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. On my Gen 1 iPod, that little screen, little touch. Oh god, I remember those. I remember like seeing kids in high school with those and thinking they were the shit. And then I think I got like an off brand one. And I was like so unenthused with it. Like, compared to this one that my mom had. Oh, God, I've heard of this weapon. 
compared to this one that my mom had that was just like this super super simple little thing like I was like this is nowhere near as cool and this spinning thing is weird oh god yeah this weapon oops I've heard legends of of this weapon Bludgeon made of an enormous finger sheathed in several heavy rings thought to have been cut from an ancestor, the Finger Creeper. Some life yet remains his legacy of the ancient act of blasphemy as evidenced by the barely perceptible warmth that still exudes. Claw flick. Cause the finger to swell, then flex to build up strength before giving enemies an almighty flick. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it, and this is why I hate it. Yep. It looks like I'm carrying a dildo. Oh, it, it saps up all my... I hate it. I hate I hate how it grows. I hate how it looks. I hate everything about it. I want nothing to do with it. I'm going to throw myself into... Wait, hold on. <laughs> but I regret it. Beat you to it. I've never played Saints Row, but I've seen footage of... um. People like the ultimate weapon is a dildo, ha 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 ha, like that kind of a thing. Yeah, that's all I can think of seeing that thing. All right, let's leave this place and never talk about it again. All right, so I'm getting the impression that this whole area is effectively nothing. So I think if we go here, we'll then be able to see what's over there. And then that probably leads to that. And then we can maybe work our way there or teleport back. <gasps> That's right. We're going to figure out what this shit is. I got to go to the bathroom though. So real quick, real quick, let's teleport to the Sage's Cave. And I'm going to take a quick bathroom break. And we'll be right. Line! Line! That's grass, Max. I don't believe you. All right, anyways, we'll be right back. So, bloop. Alright, sorry about that. Yeah. So yeah, having effectively two bottles oh, effectively having two bottles of water makes it so you have to go to the bank. No, there you go. That's right, Redress. Instead of having soda in the evenings, now I have a uh, it's called like gamer subs. Okay, fine. It's called like gamer subs. It's just like a thing you add to your water, and it's supposed to be like a really healthy version of it. And I tried a, a like a sample pack of it. It's pretty good. Max, I swear to goodness, if you don't get water poisoning. <laughs> oh shit! This is not. Well, this isn't where I thought I was gonna. 
This is not where I thought I was going to pop up. It's unfortunate. Well, alright, we'll just have to go from the other way and... Oh, it's a fucking plant. Alright, um... Um... Okay, so... How do we get up there? Probably there, and then go to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. So you tell me to dump all 100 so you to drink one... Someone did that before, like... I, what, wait, was it you guys? Who was it? That they just, like hit it like 10 times they hit it like 10 times I had to look at them and say all right let's be reasonable now, she's passed into the lands that lie beyond the okay so oh I forgot to take off the bloodhound step ah whatever next time I rest I'll switch it out it's no big deal where you can actually overhydrate yeah you can get the it, water poisoning is a real thing it sounds silly though, because it's like water's good for you. It's like, yeah, but if you drink too much of it. It sounds silly, but it's a real thing. Say, so I heard something. Alright, I'm just gonna take it for granted. It's because I'm attacking with literally their weakness that they're dying this easily. Somewhere in here, though. Somewhere in here, though. There's gotta be. Ooh, you got a scythe. Me. That's my war cry. I don't know if you know that. Max's water is fuck. Let's see. That must be such a boring way to die. Poor. Okay, the word boring, that is not the word I thought you would use. <laughs> See, I thought you would say ironic. You know, like in an attempt to be healthier, you killed yourself, but... What a boring way... I mean, I imagine it would just be like you would feel awful, and it would just be like a shit ton of vomiting, but... To call... I just imagine you at someone's funeral. <laughs> just being like, oh, they died because of that? How boring. Wait a second, I've been here before. You can tell, cause... What? So that must be the one in this ruins. Yeah, cause that just was... Oh, board. Ah, like water, but... Eh. <laughs> yeah, I'm just imagining you at someone's funeral. It's like someone's dear grandpa or so. You know, some beloved figure dies. And you're like, how'd he die? Well, the doctor said for him to drink water. And he drank water and he died. It's like, wow, that's dull. Not well, like, didn't die fighting a bear or something? You, you died drinking water? It's kind of cringe, bro. Actually, I think just going to any funeral and making the statement, you died of blank, that's kind of cringe. <laughs> that alone is terrible. Okay, we found, we found the dungeon. Good, good. This is what I was concerned about. Surfboard and getting eaten by a shark. <laughs> hey, if you're eaten by a shark, and make a good story, at least. He would not stop drinking alcohol, no water. <laughs> Uh, is it is it like the point of waterboarding that like it's really hard to actually be killed by it? Be wary of underground. I don't know what you mean. Woo! Shit! That actually, sp that actually spooked me. That spooked me a good one. I was I wasn't expecting the z of it. Oh, God. Fucking. Okay. Uh. Let's see. Lightning motherfucker. Do I, do I throw lightning? To play this game, bitch. Okay, we don't have to ride the guillotine up, though, right? Because last time we did, and it was annoying.
Okay, well, you're the obvious one. Which means there's probably... Yep! There's probably two or three more. Bunk. Oh, shit. There you go. Let's see. Uh... Yeah, it's gonna try and breathe in air through a soaked rag as they're pouring more water. That's something I've never really, um, well, I haven't done the most research into waterboarding. But that's the idea of it, right? Like, but what I don't get is how is having a soaked rag on your face make you feel like drowning even when you're not? Yeah, this, like, I'm, I'm gonna get on, I'm gonna get on, like, an FBI watch list for... For like wanting to Google it, but it's a genuine curiosity. Why answers that question? Sewers. Well, all right, I know the trick to this. You just run past. You just run real, real fast. All right. And presumably that guy needs to die. Sup? That's right, I had the wrong weapon now, because I'm a tactical genius. I don't know if you knew that, mister. I'm pretty smart. You can tell I'm smart, because I tried to hit you with my... Oh, no. You can tell I'm pretty smart, because I tried to hit you with my talisman. Seek, lift, and then crab. Oh, good. See, you're inhaling the water that goes through the rag. And... Okay. And... Chalk that up as... Chalk that up as one of those things that I really wish I never would experience. But would be interesting nonetheless to experience. Woo! Every time. All right, let's just uh, plug that bad boy in. And snagalag dish. Lightning scorpion charm. Okay. That's why they cough up water after the whip the rag off your face to ask questions. Oh, right, because like you're trying to inhale the, I gotcha, I gotcha. Oh, this is... I don't know what's going on here, but I don't like it. Oh. Hold on. I think what I love about having that as a sound bite is it's so over the top. And meanwhile, I'm, I'm like looking at the situation like, ah, this isn't that bad. It's just like, oh, no. Okay, where's the crab? I was promised crab. This is too many crabs. Ah, this is fine, actually. This is fine. Ooh! 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 Ooh-wee! Ooh! 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 Okay, hold on, hold on. So, Frenzy, Cookbook, Frenzy, Flamestone. No one gives a shit about that. I give a shit about this. Lightning Green! Wait, oops. 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 Lightning Grease! Ah, <laughs> uh, someone do the math. See, it, but it's too fucking expected. Make, make it one point, so you can spam it. Heck no, there's gotta be some. There's gotta be some control here. Granted. Cool. I was warned that if it gets abused too much, I have to set some kind of time limit on it. But we haven't ran to that situation yet, so. I don't feel like doing it yet. <laughs> Two points. <laughs> I am a merciful god. <laughs> yeah, 
Did you get that ass? <laughs> Oh, that got me. I'm sorry. Alright, anyways. <laughs> I'm gonna save up my point. <laughs> uh, okay, sorry. Yeah. It's the absurdity. That's what got me. Alright. There you go. Perfect. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're just gonna do that. We're gonna let it go up. And then... Let's go. Wow. Oh, it was fine. I wasn't gonna hit spikes at all. Like it, it was just to screw with me. Oh, well, it's just perfect. No, 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 don't, don't fucking ruin this for me. Don't, you fucking ruined it for me. I drank the wrong one. You fucking. Ru Fat. Oh well. But we can get back there like we split. Let's see. Are you sure about that, Max? That didn't seem like it was going all the way up. Oh, may maybe maybe it stopped because I got off of it. Yeah, maybe it maybe it stopped because I got off of it. That's 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 fair. Alright. Um alright, Ash Explorer. We're gonna switch this out with Fuck it, give me the give me the double slash back. How about you fuck around and find out? <laughs> I can feel the dare. I can feel Damn it. Just just that that snide daring like how about it? How about it, Max? Do you think you're hot shit? Fuck around and find out. Come on. What are you a pussy? You're not gonna do it? Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. See, when I went on the stream, I th I was under the distinct impression that I wasn't watching a bitch. Ah, I guess I am. Ah, it's real unfortunate, but, uh, you know, I, I just, I, you know, hey, I expected better of you, and you, you know, you just, uh, you just didn't follow through. And hey, I understand, I understand, you know, we all underperform, especially, you know, lesser men. Sometimes lesser men underperform. Shit happens, it's okay. The first step is acceptance. And, uh, yeah, just, uh, yeah, I just, yeah, I, th I thought you'd be a better person, but I, I guess not. Boop, boop, boop. Me. Wow, I hit that emitter. Yeah, Max is chickens out. All right. Uh, we're just gonna run past all those slimes, run past all these hollows. Ah, uh, we gotta still kill you. And bitch. Oh yeah. Oh shit. Papa. Well, that plan did not quite work. Wah -wah. That plan also didn't work. There you go. Worked enough. Ah, yeah, yeah, enough. Yeah, good enough. Just like that. Okay, so. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I'm gonna ruin this boy's life. Ba -ba! All right. Well, that worked out perfect. I love how he carries that thing. Like he's like, eh, eh, like you can't quite lift it. It's so cute. You keep an eye on that statue. Wah 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 wah. Let's see. I hear, I hear Glucky. Uh, but I don't want to die, like, uh. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay. Yep. Whoa, that little hop. Oh, that little hop is too good. Boop. 
ballsy. Not the way I should be playing. That trap didn't go off. Why didn't that trap go off? What the fuck? Yeah, I love that little flick. I thought I did step on it. Yeah, I love that little flick where it's like, eh? eh yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know. There's, there's, a, there's like almost a personality to it. Alright, let's go mess up this boss. Ah, sh shit. Fuck you. No, fuck you. Fuck you. Womp womp. Womp womp womp. Womp. Yeah, I was gonna say I have no stamina, so this is ballsy as shit. Yep, you run a hole. Oh, it's Glove Wart's picker. Yeah, so it's. I mean, it's good, but it's not like. It's not like, oh my goodness, you're here with me. It's like, it's alright, bro. It's okay. Now, if it was a spinning stone, I'd be a lot more like, oh shit, but it's not, so. Alright, so next up, uh, let's explore over here. And then otherwise, let's go over there, see if we can find a nice way down. Otherwise, I'm just going to have to say we're done with this area. It is kind of odd that there are a bunch of spots in the map that just seem... Like, maybe they're not, but they just seem mostly inaccessible. And I get, like, their goal is, like, you know, the, the goal is to make the world seem huge and everything. But, I don't know, there's a part of me that's just kind of like, oh, I guess this whole part is just inaccessible so I have it you know what I mean I'm gonna make a bet that I can't actually do that okay they want me to actually follow the road Max what are you doing We're gonna get to that place. We're gonna get to that place that has what is definitely not grass. Okay, I know I know you keep saying it's grass, but it's totally not. It's, it's not grass. It's not. I'm. I I am I'm willing to I'm willing to make a bet. It's not grass. It probably is, but yeah. No. You. You. Whoop! Got a blood blade thing. That's kind of cool. It's always fucking crap. Oh, it's a troll. Okay, never mind. I was going to say, like, oh, God, what is this? Like, wait, I've, I've fought tons of these things. been a little while since I've seen you. Sup. <laughs> ah, get dog done. Bam, bam, boom, boom. I was gonna say, if you let me get that combo off again, you're dead. Oh, speak of the devil. Alright, there's another Hoodrama call it. Excuse me, mister. I don't know why the phrase that mister is the sister just popped in my head, but it did. It ten million percent point in percent is grass, but I don't think it is. I I feel like I feel like I'm being tricked. 
I feel like it's not. Man, I'm so mad. Oh, so angry. And problem solved. No witnesses. All right. This is what I'm interested in. This right here. Old Altus Tunnel. Because you see, whenever on the map it shows that like little meteorite looking thing. I think that's where a smithing stone is supposed A smithing or bell bear, whatever the fuck it is supposed to be. So I'm excited. Why would I lie for my own amusement? Yes. <laughs> yes, you would. I just hope this isn't one of those tunnels that, um, the other tunnels that we've been to, there's been a lot of like going up and down elevators and having to like jump off at the right points. I hate that shit. I get why it's there. I understand it's a fun enough mechanic, but I always stress out that I'm missing stuff. Have I been here? I'm deeply hurt. I'm deeply hurt that you would reference however many streams that I've been a part of that you consistently do this shit. I, I, this is copy pasted from a different dungeon. Max, a bunch of them are. Well, it still hurts to see. Bish. Am I over leveled? Should I have done the Altus Plateau sooner? Click the link now to click the link now to take the online quiz to see whether or not Max is over leveled for this area. Cause I'm thinking I am. No, it's completely original. I don't know, some of it some of where everything's positioned. Like I get that they would have templates, but I'm starting to notice them. Templates are fine until you start noticing. Then they stop being fine. Well, okay, that's not necessarily true. It's half true. Um, just gonna jump on top of that. I don't even know why. I just am. I think that was actually the. Okay, never mind. I was gonna say, like, did. Was that actually the path I was supposed to take? Ah! Bump. Oh, shit! Okay, I'm gonna drink up. But, ah, I almost got him. That would've been beautiful. All right. There you go. Whoop, whoop. There you go. So that got a little spooky. That's why I got quiet. Let's see, you are looking for copies where there are none. Okay. Kind of feels like it, though. Troll's hammer? Cool, I'll never use it. Oh, yeah. But yeah, that, that what just happened right there, not gonna lie, that was, I got a little, I got a little close. Boss ahead, but first off ladder. Why first off ladder? I was just oh okay, because that 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 was where I just yeah okay. So they they're just trying to be like hey, you know, make sure you get that up here. Okay, 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 okay. okay. You know what? I haven't seen Tish work yet. Let let's give Tish a chance. Perfect. Why can't I summon Tish? Oh, I don't have enough juice. All right, Tish. I'm, here's my goal. I'm gonna do nothing. I'm just gonna let Tish work. Hey, getting a little close to the audience there. Hey, no, I'm not part of the show. I'm not part of the show. All right, this is on Tish.
Tish? I just took damage. What the fuck? Is it TJ or Tish? I have no idea. I'm pretty sure she has more health than he does. Throw that shit at me! Hi. How's it going? She's just like looking over at me like, I will fuck you up. I will murder you. Um. Was I supposed to... Cause she's like... Yeah, cause she's like, you're... She's like, you're a bitch, Max. You let me do the whole fight. Fuck you. Oh, so, okay, so real quick, before I leave this area, uh, we should Google, just to be safe, Old uh, old Altus Tunnel. Um, normally these places have, have bell bearings. Like, is there one in here? We just missed it? Uh, yeah. No? Huh. Guess... I guess it was just, uh... That's disappointing. I thought... I thought there was supposed to always... I thought there was supposed to always be a... A thing. I was right. They do have hands. So, yeah, that whole place of frenzied people is... Sure. Alright, well, that... Okay, that... Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. That was a little disappointing. I I got I I'll admit I got real excited. I was hoping for infinite smithing stones, but Yeah, what do you gotta do, right? Alright, let's go to the place that's definitely not grass. Definitely not grass. Let's see what. Would you look at? Wait, hold on. Oh no, no, no. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. Guys, I could be wrong. Guys, I could be wrong. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo, no. We don't wanna. We don't wanna. We, we don't wanna just you know say anything. We don't wanna suppose. Would you look at that shit? Would you just look at that shit? Well, just shit damn. I didn't see it coming. <laughs> red Ru uh, not Red Ru Yeah, actually, no, I blame Red Red Rus How could- how- oh, shit. I'm not gonna let me jump the fence, what the fuck? I can't- I can't believe Red Rus lied to me and said that it was grass. Like, I- I should have known he would betray me in the end. And definitely not an account of me just misspeaking now. Uh, why? Why do you have Scarlet Rock? Why do you just want to have Scarlet Rock? How dare Red was like, <laughs> bitch! That was me misspeaking. I apologize. <laughs> Ah, damn it. Ah, the spell still popped off. The, st the spell still popped off. What did I do now? Not nothing, man. You're good. You're good. I, I misspoke. Because Jailwood was insisting that this area was grass, and I was looking at him like, mm, that there's poison. You're, you're, all, you're all good, man. <laughs> Damn it. There you go. At least I got this nice spell that lets me just say, fuck all your poison and shit. Come on. I'm trying to kill these babies. And you can take that to the bank. Oh, yeah. Bish. 
Okay, I'm, I'm actually pretty banged up. All right. And yep. Wah 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 wah. Whoa. Oh no 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 no. All right, we're good. Got out of there just in the nick of time. All right, so. Um. Yeah. Okay, let's explore over here just because we can. There might be a dungeon or something. Or maybe. Well, I hate this shit. Um. Was this just where they dumped statues they didn't think looked good? Is that a dude? Whoa! I got a sudden feeling. Uh, that guy's got a Scarlet Rot Rapier. Mela Maria Shaded Castle Castellan. All right, can you define what at least two of those words are? Like, well, a shaded, not what I meant. Okay, what about castle? That's also not what I meant. Okay, sir, can you stop laying down to do a swing? Like, shit. Also, I just got a bunch of stuff. I don't know what it is. I don't have time to process it. Hang right, on. Meh, meh. You didn't die immediately. You're supposed to die immediately when I do that bit. Hey, yep. You're welcome. All right, hold on. Eh, nah, 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 nah. I don't know how much damage it's actually doing. It might be like negligible. No, come on. I wanted, I wanted to, damn it. Ah, uh, no, you're almost out. You're almost out of the running. Shit. All right, we're good, we're good. Yup. Okay. But yeah, what is this? Like the area of reject statues? It's odd. Also, I just got a mask. Not this one. It was this one. Uh, Increases arcane. Okay, that's kind of cool. But more importantly than that, I just got a rapier. I think I just got a whole lot of people's favorite weapon just now without even really realizing it. I'm willing to bet I did. Um, this one? Yep, Scarlet Rot buildup. Spur of a giant ant which has been fashioned to a rapier. The blade drips of Scarlet Rot. Indeed, he eventually found his own personal goddess of Malai Marias of the Shaded Castle. That must be the next area. Skill that lets piercing armaments overcome enemy shields build power. Yep. I'm willing to bet. I, I bet there's a poison rapier, and I bet people mix these two. They mix those two together. Uh, no, no. I said the area was ass. <laughs> Forgot to press enter. Oops. You're all good, man. But, um, gal, a scarlet rot rapier. I mean that, though. Like, mix it with a poison rapier. Have some fun. Heck, mi mix it with that one rapier I got that does ice. I'm in. Yeah. I see you, asshole. Actually, wait, no, no. I can't, I can't, I can't go in yet. I can't go in yet. We got we to check the other side of the moat real quick. But he said... Okay, he said that um he was a... Okay, hold on. Sorry, I, I go through descriptions way too fast, and I recognize that. The whole reading comprehension. Yeah, the whole reading comprehension bullshit. Okay. Scarlet Ra is an old legend of which Malay Marias of the Shaded Castle was a private believer, and indeed he eventually found his own personal goddess. Hmm. And you're still covered with the first spell that gets rid of rot and poison. Yeah, it's true. If someone had that, they'd be able to counter my bullshit, but... 
Or, oh, you mean more me that I'm here, so I have that spell, so I'm basically good. Because it's an incredible spell. Like, it's just on paper, like, hey, don't worry about it. Like, it's so freaking good. Oh, shit! That filled up fast. Hold on. Nope. Nope. <laughs> that filled up way faster than I thought it would. Yeah, we're just gonna... We're gonna play this a little cheap just for a little bit. While it refills. Nope. Oh, come on. Alright, there we go. But, um... Okay, so correct me if I'm wrong. We haven't really learned truly... Hey, little guy. And yeah, he's gone. We haven't really truly learned what Scarlet Rot is, right? All we really know is Kaled is pretty much 100% infested with it. But we don't really know what it is, what its function is, how it originally came to be. I mean, like, okay, so it kills us, but a lot of other things seem to thrive on it. And it also seems to be affecting nature around it. And, um... Radan was infected with it, or Radigan, or whatever his name was, like it was a cancer? It's... it's odd. I'm not entirely sure how much or how little of a role that rot has. Like, is that rot the reason the tree's fucking up and not letting people die, which is why I'm a thing, or...? These are lore questions I don't have the answer to. Like, I... Like, I, I can take a step back and recognize, like, well, Max, have you been paying attention? No. Well, there you go. That's your answer. God, I hope I entered the right way. Whee! Because, yeah, I just... These guys seem to have Scarlet Rot. I'm gonna... No, these guys just have basic bitch poison. Why would you be a private believer in the rot? Unless it's like, like there's some kind of spiritual something. Don't they leave a lot of questions unanswered in these games? Yeah, yeah. And I've I've gone back and forth with um. Yeah, I've gone back and forth with um Souls games and like how much or how little they tell. My philosophy, and this this philosophy originally came from Five Nights at Freddy's. Actually, no, no, no. Okay. It came from Five Nights at Freddy's, but it was solidified by Hyper Light Drifter. That a story is not a good story unless without any... Or a story is not a good story in a video game, or at least not told very well. If you are unable to get the basic plot of it without the aid of any other videos, just the average, or any explanations, just the average playthrough, you should be able to tell me what the basic story beats are. It doesn't mean you have to know everything, that doesn't mean you have to be an expert, but you should be able to tell me the basic story beats. Because I remember we were trying to figure out like what the heck was going on in, um, the whole place. We were trying to figure out, like, what the plot of Hyper Light Drifter was. And there's all sorts of different answers, and a lot of them came down to, eh, it's up to your interpretation. And then I remember seeing a few posts that were basically to the effect of, if you can't come up with your own interpretation, then that means you lack imagination, and you just expect people to give you the answers instead of having to seek it out on your own. Maybe? I don't know. Whoa, shoot. Oh, it's one of you guys. It's a perfumer. Yeah, like, I remember seeing multiple posts where people were, like, just being really cynical and mean about it. 
You are the character you created, so how would you know? I know it's kind of a cop-out, though. You know what? That's a fair cop-out. That's a fair cop-out. And I want to say it for the record, I'm not against a game hiding things and not telling you any anything. Heck, I love Silent Hill, and the grand majority of shit in Silent Hill is not explained. But it's kind of embraced, and you still understand the basic story beats. You understand the why of the situation, you understand the how. Even if the even if part of the how comes down to shit man, Silent Hill's weird. We still could get a Fuck you. We still have a very general sense or I shouldn't say general. We still have a very good sense of the story of Silent Hill, even if a lot of the details are confusing. You know, how is this city specifically reading your mind and manifesting parts of your ass, parts of yourself that are either your sins and your guilt or your whatever? How does the city do it? Fuck if we know, but that's the situation. We can understand the rest of the story around it. How, how would any of them know or understand the ongoing side from the piece of the world that the characters give? Right, exactly. I that I, That's why I go back and forth with that. Like, okay, let's take, I don't know, let's take Sekiro, for example. Okay, let, let's compare Sekiro, which I, oh shit, which I absolutely loved compared to like other Dark Souls games, right? A lot of weird stuff happened in Sekiro, but, at the end of the day, it's pretty straightforward, the situation of some people want to use the blood of the whatever it is to gain immortality to save their kingdom, and other people were like, no, no, that's a horrible idea. If you do that, like, a, a disease will inflict the countryside, and it'll suck ass. And that's why, like, the endings involve your choice with that, and da 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 da, da right? Now... Why does the, why does his blood do that in particular? Why does, um, why are there so many weird spiritual monsters? Why is there a giant fish with teeth? Why is there a giant snake? Sure, I'd like to know these things, but it's okay. Oh. Like, I am, oops. You know, like, I don't know those things, but I'm okay with it because I know the basic story beats, right? It's the same thing with, like, Five Nights at Freddy's. It's the same thing with um, Hyper Light Drifter. If everyone can agree on what the basic premise of the storyline is, then we can have as many other little mysteries and whatever as we like. As long as we get to that point that the basic story beats are understood. Don't forget about the dragon. That's true, yeah. Like, okay, let, let's take Dark Souls 1, for example, right? I love Dark Souls 1. Dark Souls 1 is a phenomenal game. Okay, who's the bad guy? Actually, no. Let me ask a better question. Is Gwyn the villain? Because I remember when I first played that game, I thought he just went mad, and that was the end of it. No, and it basically was summed up. I, someone had to explain it to me that he was the one that started the whole immortality thing because he was afraid of dying. That he was the one that was the cause of the endless cycle between, like, light and dark. And he just selfishly didn't want it to go dark, so he, like, so he set up this system of people dying to keep the world alight. And it's like, oh, so we should let the world go dark. Well, we don't know what the dark is. Well, what is it? We don't know. So is it bad? Because we monsters and abyss things keep coming out of the dark. Yeah, but maybe it's better if you just let the world die. Is it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, apparently, Gwyn, or whatever his name is, the final boss of Dark Souls 1 is the original reason that there's a cycle between life and death and fire and dark and da 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 and he's an asshole because he branded the whole world with the undeath, Halloween, whatever bullshit because he didn't want to lose out on his legacy and die. But was he trying to stave off? Yes. Yes. But was he trying to stave off the dark? Or er, 
was he doing the right thing because of the sp the the embers being used to fight the dragons? Was he? There's all sorts of stuff, and sure, there's like summary videos and things, right? But the average player, the average pleb, who Let's assume they read some item descriptions. Let's assume they talk to the NPCs they can. Yeah, exactly! I remember it was the first time I was told, it's like, yeah, you're kind of an asshole if you just continue the fire, you should just let it go out. And I'm like, no! The Abyss is scary! Manus is in there! All sorts of crazy shit's in there! Every place that embraced the Abyss in the dark turns evil! Why the fuck would I want that? But apparently that's like the right way to go according to some people in the lore and you know i appreciate needing to interpret lore but it shouldn't be to that point like if someone in game convinced you why the dark was why darkness was the tits and you agree to go with it then sure fine but i never really and to this day i still don't in dark souls one i don't have a solid sense of why that's the point of lore is to divide the fan base in half <laughs> ah yes we specifically made the most confusing lore possible just to make you guys argue <laughs> that way you talk about our game longer ha 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 jokes on you <laughs> that actually be pretty funny though but um yeah I remember that was something that just genuinely I genuinely don't like about Dark Souls 1 that, like, at the end of the day, there's no clear villain and there's no clear hero. Oh, Max, real life is like that. You know, there's, it's not, everything is not just black and white, blah, blah, blah. Okay, fine. You know, life isn't in, life isn't all black and whites. Fine. Okay, I can accept that. We need to have someone out there. We need to have someone out there with an opinion of some kind, a philosophy of some kind, a goal of some kind, right? And they need to describe this goal, philosophy, whatever. And then we can look at them and say if we disagree or not. And then other people need to bring forth their goals and philosophies, and we decide whether or not we want to agree with them, or we say fuck it, and we go with the frenzied flame where we just burn this fucker to the ground. Which isn't really a solution, but that's an opinion question more than anything. Anyone who starts any political or whatever opinion with, we need to just burn this whole thing down, I don't trust them. But, anyways. Because, to me, that's a quitter attitude. But yeah, Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls 3, they all kind of have that same issue for me. Like, um, Bloodborne, I feel like, was a lot more cut and dry. Actually, no. Sekiro was extremely cut and dry. Roe v. Wade. Oh, we can get into that a little later. Let me finish my rant. But, um... What was I saying? Damn it, I lost it. Okay, so Sekiro was, I feel like, incredibly like, Alright, here's the situation, boys, and here's what we need to do about it. Like, it was pretty... Right? Bloodborne was a lot more mysterious, but you basically got the gist of... We're playing with eldritch gods, and... Okay, you know, you... You escaped the dream, you got what you want out of it, you played with gods, you endured madness, and you got out Scott clean. Or you embrace the madness and become the lord of this weird, unknown, mirror, dream dimension bullshit. It felt... It felt like it made more sense! Hey, it happens... Oh, I forgot to put... Oh! Pfft. Damn it. Wait, your stats for your stream on... What the fuck? Weird. Um, let me just put that on silent. Sorry about that. But, um, it felt like it made more sense. There was a lot more cohesion going on, and I could understand the whys of the world and everything. Oh, shit. Ba -ba. Oh, shit. The light of God. Oh, oh sorry. But, um, it felt like it made a lot more sense. Like, the pieces fit together, the reasons felt better. There's still a lot of mystery, but you got the basic story beats, and that's what I care about. While in Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3... <gasps> if I hand this to Millennia, will she love me? 
Max, that's not her name. I forgot her name! Oh, uh, I bet if I hand this to What's-Her-Face. Uh... When Malay Marias, Lord of the Shade Castle, embraces Persesis, he claimed to feel the presence of his personal goddess. I should hand this to What's-Her-Face! So that way she can have an arm again! I feel like this is gonna backfire somehow! Yeah! Right, but, um... Yeah, that's something that genuinely bothers me about Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3. That, like, there's a lot when it comes to the lore that... No matter what, you feel like an asshole. Like, you're an asshole if... You're, you're a tall boy. Like, you're an asshole if you light the flame because you're just continuing the problem. You're an asshole if you put out the flame because you make the world dark and awful. You're an asshole if you consume the flame or have your firekeeper consume the flame. Max, I have no doubt you have seen clips of her fight. I've seen artwork. I think I know who this is. And I'm excited. I'm very excited. Because she's supposed to be just as bad, if not worse, than Rodan. Or she's supposed to be like... You know, every game has that one boss that just, like, fucks everyone over. And it's her. I, I heard it was her and Rodan. And Rodan was a piece of cake. So I'm excited. I read that type. You've seen her girth. I'm like, oh, God. I don't want to see her girth. I'm not into this. This isn't my fetish. Like, it's your fetish now, boy. Oh. Oh shit, I can barely even move. I got to get Bloodhound step again. That right there is a concern. That shit. Alright, just gonna take this and then take this. Alright. You quit being an asshole. Quit throwing your frenzy bullshit at me. I missed. There you go. Oh shit! Ah, damn it. She has some childbearing hips though. <laughs> Look, we'll 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 talk about waifu material when we get to that point. As of right now, though, we got a problem. It's that I can't summon my horse. So we're just gonna have to kind of suck up this poison, which means we are sitting. Perfect. Me. Anyways, that that's basically the end of my rant. I'm I'm a hundred or to summarize my rant, I should say, I'm a hundred percent cool and I love it when a game is willing to give you a mystery and I'm okay. Like you know, it may bother me a bit, but I'm okay with a game being willing to leave things up to you. And your mind, right? Like, you have to think about it. Waifu met, I'm Randy all the way. <laughs> we'll get to the Roe Wade ra We'll get to the row Wade rant, and then I can make you hate me. It'll be fun. But, um, spend your 2,000 pixels, and maybe... I'm, I'm joking. I'm joking. We'll talk about it in a second. But, um... Shit, shit. Shit. And this blue... <laughs> Oh, I, I, just, I just realized I drank the wrong one. Damn it. Oh, well, it's fine. I'll live. Four arms is always winking at you. Oh, shit. Shit. That was mean. Damn. Yeah, to summarize, I'm okay with the story having mystery. I'm okay with the story not telling you everything. I'm okay with the story being vague and being like, ooh, what are you going to do? But the basics, the basics. Oops. The basic, basic, basic story beats need to be easily digestible and understood. So, using Silent Hill as an example, there's all sorts of weird shit that happens with Silent Hill. All sorts of weird theories. And it's all well and good, right? But at the end of the day, we all understand the basic story beats. You know, James Sunderland goes there because it uh, goes there because the place calls to him and we realize that Maria is a manifestation of his lust or whatever 
and and Pyramid Head is a manifestation of his guilt and desire for self punishment. And we get a general idea of what the relationship was. We get a general idea of like dope hot hat noted. <laughs> also said dope hot. <laughs> also has a dope hot. <sighs> Sorry. Um, we get a general idea of what's going on. Si like Silent Hill 1, at the end of the day, people are trying to summon Satan and we're going to stop them. And they're using our daughter as a catalyst or some shit. Um, at the end of the day... At the end of the day in Silent Hill 3, we got to... Oh, hey. Oh, look at that. We gotta go save our uh, we gotta go save our dad and then our dad dies and we're like this weird half thing. Okay, maybe that one doesn't make sense. But we get the general idea. We get the gist. And that's all I want. I just I just want the Oh, it's up there, that's right. I just want the gist to be consistent. That's all. Alright, now the rover the Roe versus Wade thing. I'm gonna talk around my ass for a hot minute, okay? Just real quick, I'm going to talk out of my ass real quick. If I remember correctly, and if I'm wrong, please tell me. I want to make that very clear. Because I'm not an expert on legal things. I'm not an expert on the law. I haven't read it personally myself. Uh, I like watching Steven Crowder and Tim Pool and like a few other things. So I, I tend to be very conservative, right-wing leaning, whatever you wanted. I think the Orange Man was pretty cool. I'm also a white male Christian conservative. So you know, if there's any reason Twitter's going to get me banned, it's for that. But nope. But I also want to make it clear: I am I am totally cool with people disagreeing with me. I think the most important thing in our culture is critical thinking and being okay with an opinion that you disagree with. Just because someone's different or someone's whatever doesn't mean you shouldn't be doesn't mean you should be afraid of them. It means you should talk, and if you disagree, that's okay. You know, we can be civil at the end of this. Anyways, I'm banned from Twitter for a lot of things I just said. But, but, right, to my knowledge, Roe versus Wade is primarily about privacy, and it was ultimately used to make it so that it was required by the government. Or, okay, this is something I'm not 100% clear on. So just, you know, me being honest about my shortcomings, right? I'm not 100%. From what I understand of Roe versus Wade, isn't it about, like, medical privacy and the like? So how does that translate to abortions or a constitutional right? I'm not 100% sure on that. Where am I? That looks like a whole bunch of people have the same idea I had. Eh, well, shit. Yeah, so, you know, to my knowledge, right... To my knowledge, somehow, something about medical privacy became... Oh, shit. Well, that worked out positively perfect right there. But, um... To my knowledge, somehow, something about medical... Ugh. Something about medical privacy w became... Abortion is a human right. And once again, just speaking generally, right? I'm not a girl. I've never had a child. So there's a certain amount of your opinion doesn't count. Ah, but I, f but I feel like it does to a certain extent. Everyone can have an opinion. And it strikes me that a human life is a human life and abortion is bad. And oh, what about rape and it? Look at that. Oh, what about, like, rape and incest and stuff? Uh, there was some study I saw, and I, once again, I could be talking out my butt. I don't have the study available. That was, like, the number of cases when it comes to abortion. Yeah, suck it. Is, like, it's very little. It's, like, one and a half, per one and a half percent or some shit. The majority of cases when it comes to abortion are not rape and incest so in general my opinion is I don't approve of abortion because I think it's a life the only time I could see it being justified is if the mom's life is in danger or something like that and even then right so that's me personally 
Let's see. Right, that's kind of, that's what it comes down to. You're taking away the choice of a baby. You're, it's still a life. And I'm, I'm not, I'm not about that. No, I'm, I'm not about that. And with all the different ways to make it so you're not pregnant, you, you know, other than rape and incest, right? And even then, there's adoption. There's all sorts of stuff. Oh, Max, but the adoption system screwed up. Well, then there's the concern. We need to work on that and fix that. I, I'm not an expert, but if there's a problem with that system, it can be investigated. We can look into it, right? I feel like that's fairly reasonable. Where am I going? I remember where I'm going. Oh, shit. Um. Wait, what? So maybe you shouldn't talk about this as they love to cancel news and agree. Will you okay RE2 a remake after Ellie? We fin we finished the we finished the DLCs. So uh we're basically doing a franchise series and uh a franchise series and a single series. So we're so it's gonna be Elden Ring today, Elden Ring on Friday, and then um RE three remake will be on Monday. And speedruns, I'm not good enough at the game to do a speedrun. Just gonna tell you that right now. I can see an item there and I want it. But I'm not sure I can get it. But, um... Yeah, so... If... Like, if... Someone came up to me with the argument, they basically said, like... Would you still allow abortion in those cases, but not in other cases? If I have to take that compromise, fine. If it means less lives being lost. But, like I said, that is my opinion. So the Roe vs. Wade thing, once again, to my knowledge, I'm not perfect, right? I want to keep, I want to continually emphasize that. I don't know if this is how you're supposed to get to that item, but I'm doing it. Like, I want to sit here and continually emphasize that, right? Is... Like, okay, so instead of being federal, it's to the state. Well, if it's to the state, then you could still get your abortion if you feel like it. I disagree with it, but if your state says you can, your state says you... I don't think this is how you're supposed to do it. Oh, well. Yeah, <laughs> suck it. All right, we'll just leave that alone then. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, maybe, there, maybe there's a way to do it. So if your state still allows you to do it, then it's not the end of the world. And if you live in a state where that it does allow you to do it, and this is something you do strongly believe in, you you probably move to a different state that lets you do it. If you are really that devoted to killing babies, I don't approve, but if your heart, if your if all your life choices and decisions are contingent on whether or not you can kill a baby instead of properly using different methods that are available to you to make it so you don't get pregnant, then I guess, because then it would be a state decision. If it was up to me, it would be completely banned in the first place because it's killing babies. But I don't care why people are throwing riots, and I think people are more using it as an excuse to start riots and to justify violence and stuff in order to fear monger and to like force people to try to see their way because they don't have a real opinion on the matter. And it's more about worshiping the self and burning babies in your own image and blah, blah, blah. Religious similarities and parallels to whatever. And like, I don't know why people are so excited to kill a baby. It's a baby for Pete's sake. Like, the fuck's wrong with it? Anyways. <laughs> Anyways. Uh... Uh... Does the foster care also needs a huge order for the kids who end up putting a punch this and it takes care of kids who are born from pregnancy has a lot of flaws, quite a few stations, state stations. No, I, I, I'm, I promise I'm trying to keep it. I'm, I mean, okay, I, I, I'm gonna see you mean like between major political figures and yeah, definitely. But, um, that, uh, like I said though, and I don't want anyone to get mad, this is meant to be peaceful discussion. I'm. I'm very willing to hear out others' opinions, but in my opinion, 
it's murder and it shouldn't be there in the first place. And if it does have to be allowed by state, fine. I'd prefer it only being done in rare legal situations. But ultimately, I don't, I don't think abortion is the thing. I think it's being used as a reason to cause riots and shit. And apparently there are some people who are saying this could be the start of civil, of the Civil War because enough people are again that like angry about it. To which I'd say, what a dumb reason to start a Civil War. But... Ra 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 spooky. And you're going, you're going on Google to look for a pro-life shirt? Oh, well. Anyways, I apologize if I desperately offended anyone, but... To what Redris said, I would definitely agree. If, like, I don't know the foster system very well. This is not big enough. God, I hope it isn't. I can't imagine a civil war. Well, I can. It would be awful. But, um... Dolls to Donuts, people are going to have some riots. They're going to be shut down by the police. and that's going to be the end of it. You offended me by not lowering the point redeems. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, hey, perfect. But, um... Oh, no! You end up with more pranks. If pro-life policies better for the kids who are born due to these laws, I would probably send more to the right. Let's see. Uh... See, okay, the on-paper idea of, like... Giving every possible way for there to be contraceptives, or I always, I always feel like I'm using that word wrong, but like every, giving every way to prevent a pregnancy. Sure, good, wonderful, great, awesome, good, great. But once it's there, it's there. I don't want kids to die. Max, it's not your body, it's not your choice. Fine. It's my opinion, then. Now, where's what? <gasps> She's still there! I'm going to run over to her and hand her this arm. We're going to see what happens. <laughs> but, um, yeah, Dolls of Donuts, the people who are the most mad about there being abortions or not abortions, right, are probably living in states that will align with what they want. And if it if they aren't, they will probably move to those states and that'll be fine. But, yeah, the, the big thing, sorry, that um, I don't, I don't know the most about it, but I would definitely want is foster system and adoption system being improved i think that's really important do i know how to improve it no because i don't know the most about it I'm just gonna be honest but just on paper if improving that system would really help the situation that it should be improved and not abused take it not for second but due to their bias to be known in the process of monthly time that cause for cancer other issues i mean I think my thing with that is like, what what was it? It was Hobby Lobby. People wanted to destroy Hobby Lobby because they didn't provide what was the number sixteen different versions of contraception or whatever, as part of their health care. That seems a bit extreme, but making it as easily and readily available as possible. Eh, do I do I necessarily agree with people having sex out of wedlock and having like you know just going to town and being in orgies and stuff or whatever you know insert reason they have a crazy sex life no but it's not my life so whatever have whatever to make it so you can't have a baby okay but once there's a baby that's a life period <laughs> this is kind of my thought process and then also discovering like what babies corpses are used for what's this about orgy you know what i mean I did see something about a male birth control. I've heard of that. That is an interesting concept. Ah, well, there you go. Perfect. But, um... <laughs> oh, that's a good sign. Anyways, let's hand, let's hand this girl... In, or, let's get... Let's hand this girl... Uh, uh, uh. Now, she's passed into the night. <gasps> Give the hand! Giving you this arm. Yeah! <sighs> Thank you. Yeah, why not? I am in your debt. Yeah, why not? Here's an arm. Well enough, yeah. It might be possible for me to wield a sword again. Yeah. If the arm, it might be possible. Boo, I got you, girl. 
Whatever you're- Millicent? Girlie, I got you. I'm gonna go rest in here and then see if you're still there or not. Max, she wants to make a baby with you. Isn't she, like, corrupted by the Scarlet Rod or some shit? Kind of down? But, um... Right, and... All, let's see, all things with good proper testing, right? I lost my train of thought again. I do that a lot. Yeah, I... Like I, I feel like that's I feel like that's a pretty fair opinion. Or, uh, well, you know, it's an opinion. It doesn't have to be fair. I bet she's gonna help me with the one fight. Like I bet I can summon her to help me with this fight. Although I'm not gonna want to. Not gonna lie, I'm having a really fun time streaming, so I'm just gonna keep streaming for a bit. And nothing else is going on this evening, so it's not like the worst thing in the world if I stream more. But, um, and I really like this discussion we're having, so let's keep having it. Hey, Pope. House Marias has ruined just deserts, desserts for falling for that sever. Just desserts? No surprise that guilty Cretan took the castle on our storied sword. But, um,. I feel like I'm not being horribly cruel with that opinion. I don't know. There's probably things I don't know about. There's probably things I'm not accounting for, and I can accept that. Well, it, it's nukes your ability to produce sperm, so when you do step use, it takes five billion your sperm country. Uh... Oh, I'm not worried about offending, offending sides. That's a me thing. <laughs> Look, okay. Let me rephrase that. Let me rephrase that. Okay, because this will go into another topic. Okay, this will go. This will. This will segue. Okay. If you have a genuine opinion and you are genuinely bringing it forward, not with the intent of insulting anyone, but just hey, this is my opinion, then you should never be afraid to bring up your opinion, in fear of offending someone. Like I'm. Let's make up something absolutely awful and horrible and atrocious, right? Let's just make up something awful. Let's say it's part of my religion that rape is okay. Jeez, border. All right. Let's 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 just pretend for whatever reason, right? It's part of my religion that rape is okay. And if someone asks me, if someone asks me, what is your opinion on rape? And I'm like. Ah, well, it's, a, it's a woman's job to have sex and it doesn't matter if she screams it's better if she does you know blood makes it better is it bad that I offended them well it's my genuine opinion and if they ask they ask it might offend them but my goal isn't to hurt them I'm not just saying shit that would be my genuine opinion now obviously it isn't but that kind of an example like some if you're like Someone says, let's have an example, Redress. In the past, we talked about, we have different opinions when it comes to marijuana, right? I never want you to be scared of offending me that you're cool with marijuana and I'm not as much. Know what I mean? Yeah, exactly. Just because it offends them doesn't mean they are right. Exactly. It's, it's emotion instead of logic base. Like, it's such an important part of these kind of conversations. To like, even if I horribly disagree with someone, just hor... Like, horribly, 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 like, oh my goodness, I can't believe you said that. I should still be able to sit here, process it, and think about it. And I should expect them to do the same for me. I was just coming up with something horrible, Red Rose. So I was just like, that, that's just me, like... That's why I said something horrible and awful, because, you know, the best way to make similarities are, like, extremes and... Oh, but that leaves the slippery slope tiles. So yeah, okay, fair enough. But I was just coming up with something in general. You know what I mean? Oh. Basically, what I, basically what I'm saying is I, I hope you are never... Oh, shit. I hope you are never scared to share your opinion with me. Fury of luck. Uh, you still have to have that rape baby. Like I said, Jill, I've, it, 
when it comes to that, if the compromise is no more, like, zero abortions except for rape, incest, and the mom's life is in danger, right? I will take that compromise, 100%. I'll take that compromise because it'll cut down on a lot of it. Or even just basic food rights for it. Okay, I can, I can accept that. If, if you terramate the baby, you're worse than the rapist or those type of people. But if you terramate, if you, ter if you ter oh, terminate, terminate, okay. You're worse than the rapist or. <sighs> it, it's hard. Like, I guess for me, of, you know, people are worried, like, the mom will be arrested or something like that. It, ah, it's hard. That's hard. My first instinct is to say it depends on the situ- Is it depends on the situation, depends on the reason. If someone's sitting there and glorifying in it, and they're like, meh, hey, I don't give a shit. And, like, they clearly aren't taking the situation seriously. It's a lot different than someone being like, oh, my goodness, I'm 14 and I was raped and this is horrible and awful. And this is, like, the worst sin one man can commit to another. It's different. I'm bad at describing it and I have a little harder time talking about it, to be completely honest with you. And I have to kill this thing real quick, so. Well, I took a bet there and I lost. Okay, so even mothers who are victims or even would be more willing. That's just my take. No, I I 100% agree with that. Like it should be the best system, and then it should also be encouraged as a culture that it's good to adopt. And like there has to be a system to make it so that people who adopt aren't just abusing the system to get taxes or money or whatever, but that they're genuine caring homes. That needs to be encouraged more. Can't say there's a better system in place. Plus, getting birth costs the entry system when there's no history of your family. Oh, you mean like, like, there's not a history of whatever birthing problems and sometimes it just shows up. Okay. Sue those who want to have an abortion. I don't know enough about that to give an opinion. That seems really extreme. So I don't want to necessarily say, oh, that's crazy. Texas is stupid. You know what I mean? Like... I'm hearing something. You know what I mean? Like, to sue someone who wants to have an abortion, that feels very extreme. So I don't necessarily want to give an opinion without digging into that more. Uh... Oh, God. That is... I... Jeez. Holy shit. Right. I, I think that would fall under, like, if the mother's life is in risk kind of a deal. But I, I can I can take a step back and I can understand that concern. I'm willing to accept that. Can I, can I get this? Ooh. I'll never use it. All right. We head back down. Give ladies better health care. I'm okay with that. Like, I know people always shit on the American healthcare system, but that's because a lot of people realize that it's a rigged market, that you can just make prices however much you want, because what are you going to do, not go to the hospital to get your leg fixed? So, yeah, I think it needs to be cheaper. Do I think we need socialized health care? No. Absolutely not. No. Does it need to be much more readily available, much more... Or does it need to be much more readily available of higher quality of less people wanting to screw over people that can't afford it that make them pay obscene amounts of money because it's a captive market yeah that shit shouldn't be tolerated at all this isn't me saying socialism good capitalism bad i think capitalism is pretty great but it definitely can lead to bad and corrupt situations i.e companies who are willing to strong arm the government into making it so that they have private contract deals that force everyone in the country 
I was blocking. I need to leave. This situation just got gnarly. Okay, go, 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 go. That's right. I just ran away like a little girl. Bet you're all jealous. But, um... You know what I mean when I say that, right? Like, yo, know, is it bad that someone's rich and has a big company? No, of course not. Is it bad when you start doing really unethical shit, really forcing the government, changing laws in order to better yourselves? BlackRock, housing market, and the like. Is that shit okay? No, because that is no longer capitalism. Like, that is no longer a truly free and open market. So, yes, I can agree with that with the healthcare system. So, making things more easily and readily available. Making things cheaper and uh, cheaper and better for the customer and things so that they don't screw over the common man. 100%. I can definitely agree with that. Do I know the most about it? No, but I'm willing to bet if we just sit here and talk out different points, we could probably come up with something intelligent. Trump did fix a tiny part of it. He had capped the price of insulin, but then Biden removed that. Yeah. I missed the orange man. He wasn't perfect, but I miss him. You just got to become richer to overturn their stuff. Yeah, it's gross. I'd have thought earlier that I lost it. Border, you asked about the. Border, you asked about the. Uh... This is getting increasingly creepy. <gasps> Patches! The uh, debt versus herd thing. I will get to that in just a second. Let's see. Big companies have been doing the general populist theory for a long time. You're aware of IBM's involvement during World War II, yes. That sounds familiar, but you'll have to remind me. Sounds familiar, though. We'll get to that in a second, though. I want to talk to Patches! Oh, you, you again. Hi! Why? You're just sitting. Oh, I, I had a bit of a slip up. That's Here, have some boluses. I should have stuck to what I know best. No matter. I know I, I can trust you. Gullible, yes, but uh, a good soul. Make certain that Tanith gets this. Shit, who's Tanith? Shit, who's Tanith? Oh, it's, it's nothing, it's just... Who's Tanith? Just die. Patches. Patches. Shit. Who the fuck's Tanith? Shit. Who who the who who the who the fuck is Tanith? Tanith, 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 Tanith. Who the fuck is Tanith? Uh, uh, uh. Okay, so watch that's Patch's first name. <laughs> Elden Ring Tanith. Who the fuck is Tanith? Oh. Ep. She dead. <laughs> we, killed, we, killed, we killed her. <laughs> she, she died earlier. <laughs> so I'm saying her just like, oof. Big oof. She dead. 
let's see. Okay, so they made the serial. Let's made the, they made the serial coding system that he's using the camps. Prime example. Um, yeah, I mean, wasn't there, like, a bunch of car companies that did stuff for the Nazis? Now, yes, I could take a step back and be like, you know what? Second chances, right? But it is concerning, to say the least. Ah, oh, but what if they just change their name? That How do you... You know, the argument comes down to if someone made a mistake and they want to be better about it. And they're genuinely trying to be better about it, but that's their legacy. Do you just dissolve all their hard work, even though they're trying to be better? It's a hard question. You know what I mean? Should they have to sit there and endlessly apologize for it, for something someone did however many years ago? That's... Don't get me wrong, I don't approve of them doing it. But a lot of Nazi scientists, weren't they hired for all sorts of different things that ultimately worked out for the better? Forgiveness versus... You know what I mean? It's FC. Depending on who this boss is, we'll discuss... Well, actually, I don't even need to... Ah, hey! Elmer of the Briar. Wait a second! <laughs> Motherfucker! I'm about to get my ass kicked by this guy that I've killed four, five times. You know what? Fuck you. This is the first time I'm able to actually use summons. Oh, yeah? Shit. That's right, this is the first time I'm able to use summons on your ass. No! Rib! That was a waste. Yeah! Suck my ass. I shouldn't say that. Ooh, I got a sword. Good job. Good job, hum. Lover, oh lover. Hey, hey! <laughs> How you doing, gorgeous? <laughs> Let's see. It, it's like playing the white people nowadays for slavery and just like that, they are gone. Well, yeah. No one should be blamed for anything that their ancestors did. That's a general rule of mine. I think it's in the Bible. Leviticus, you know, obviously we don't go by Levitical law anymore, blah, blah, blah. But, you know, like, should you be blamed for the sins of your father? Probably not, in my opinion. I blame Ambrose for what she did. Oh, he's gone. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, I wonder. Oh, hey, shit. General note. We'll have to go, we'll have to go back and find what that is. Um, real quick though, okay, so notably, oh, she's still there. Um, I just wanted, I just wanted to do this for funsies. This is just a real quick for funsies. I'm gonna teleport there and see if, um, see if he's there morning or death. Yep. Oh, okay. See, this is... Okay, here's an odd thought process I have, right? It has become fashionable as of late to shit on old political figures. George Washington, Abraham Lincoln, Thomas Jefferson. It's like people relish in just... Whoa, 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 whoa. What? I could learn skills from him this whole time? Holy shit. I'm... Oh, man. Some of these are expensive. Cool. I'm going to buy these for no reason. Um, You know, it, it is... Be, in many cases, it has become fat... Sorry for a on the original ramp or line. Nah, it's fine. You cannot... 
But, um... We'll get to Amber. But, um... It has become fashionable more and more to shit on old political figures. You know, the moment they can't defend themselves... Well, actually, I shouldn't say that necessarily, but you kind of get what I'm going for, right? That, like... Actually, Abraham Lincoln sucked ass because blah, blah, blah. And, like, not giving... Wait a second. So that guy from the shack moved here? I just wanted to come here to see if... To see if, um, Patches was around to realize that his waifu was dead. Because this is where Patches was originally, right? Yeah, it is. I don't know what happens if we go to the War Master Shack. An interesting idea for an experiment. Let's do it. It appeared to well. But, um... And I don't think that's a good thing. Should, should the shortcomings or should the errors and mistakes of different people be out in the open and stuff? Sure. Why not? But it should never be at the detriment of the good they've done at the same time. Like, it's like, it should never be done at the detriment for, like, okay, sure, maybe George Washington wasn't perfect. But he did a lot of good stuff. Know what I mean? Like, I, I, I'm not a fan of that. I really dislike when it's like, look at the good that this person did. Yeah, but fuck them, because blah, blah, blah. It's like, you're just going to discount the good they did? They started America. And like, okay, yeah, Abraham Lincoln frees the slaves. Exactly. George Washington helped start fucking America. And I think America's pretty great. Grade A waifu. Nah, I'm kidding. Um, that's a me thing, right? Like, I, I don't like when people shit on those that are dead just because it's fashionable to do so. And also because the whole it's fashionable to bash on America and everything that's of Western culture and stuff. I'm not a fan of that shit either. Okay, I just, I don't like that. Where am I supposed to go? Waifu! Tell me your secrets! Um... I'm just breaking shit. I genuinely don't know where I'm supposed to go. There's gotta be... There's, there's, gotta, there's gotta be somewhere to go. So, um... Can we all agree Nazis a uh, Nazi bad? Yes. Can we agree that there are companies that don't want to admit it that now have done stuff with it? Yes. Have they apologized and are trying to do better? Yes. I don't know. Maybe maybe I'm may, I don't I don't feel like I'm doing a good job articulating myself. I feel like I'm just saying shit at this point. I apologize. Shit. I'm about to be attacked by loud dogs. So the Amber Heard thing, okay, once again, this is with my, America, let's see, coming again to save the motherfucking day. <laughs> From a Benedict Arnold in the books in school taught us too, but it's beneficial to asserts that they exile a lot of interest facts about it. I don't think of him any less, but I'm guessing there's a lot of critical thinking that could paint him in negative light, uh, should what we had done be more public from an earlier point in history. I mean, there's a lot to be said for, like, a lie to save a nation or something, right? Or, I'm sure you've heard that before. Like, no one's perfect. We're all human, right? But if what you're doing is a genuinely good thing, then I think it's good to still praise and honor people for that. Real talk. Where the fuck am I supposed to go now? No way that's the end of the... No way that's the end of the castle. Sorry, real quick. Before we continue. Before we continue. Uh... Jail, is that... Jail, is that the end of the castle? Really strikes me that that shouldn't be the end of the castle. Is that the end of the castle? I think that's the end of the castle. So all of that was just for that? I was kind of hoping we get to Melania today. I was going to kick her ass and it was going to be cool. Guess not. But, um... 
Okay, so the Amber Heard thing. Actually, I know I know how I just said, like, yeah, I'll get to it, don't worry. Once again, me with my very limited knowledge, right? Shit. Ass. On principle, I'm gonna hunt you down and kill you. But, um... Iron Ball. Me with my extremely limited knowledge, right? I mean, it basically just comes down to... She was a freaking liar and abused him horribly. And really, it becomes more of a statement on... Um, the downside of lover or lover. <laughs> Visions of I failed. People like jump on top of that thing saying, Golly, wish what's your name would do that to me. Anyways, but um, okay, the whole the whole me too believe all women thing, right? Should you believe women who say they've been sexually assaulted and stuff? Yes, does that mean you don't need evidence anymore? Nope, and that's basically as far as my mind goes with it. <laughs> like, it's very clear that she ruined his life, absolutely abused him, manipulated the shit out of him. And should be punished for it. And the fact that he, uh, that Depp lost so many different roles and things as a result of it is is just an absolute oh shit is an absolute shame. Shit. I'm about to lose my money. I'm about to lose my money. Hey, I didn't lose my money. Also, that one lady went up the elevator. I don't know to where. So I'm just gonna leave her. And like, I think a lot of it does, uh, a lot of it does kind of come down to with the Amber Heard thing of like, how does our society view marriage? How does our society view whether like if a male is abuse how should it be treated should he be shamed for it and sucked it up or should he speak out against those kinds of things so it's a lot of like acceptance of or that's not the right word be more open about that shit you can say this a lot culturally in shit fuck this thing i hate i hate that enemy uh yeah totally for her will declare bankruptcy to not pay yeah she she, from what I've seen, and obviously a lot of the media and stuff I've seen about it has been pretty one-sided, that, like, holy shit, she's a horrible person, is that it it really does seem like he'll win and that she's going to do everything she can to weasel out of it, especially since she seems to be the kind of person who will, uh, the moment they're done with the divorce, talk shit behind someone's back. That's awful. That's not good. She abused not just him, but women who actually are victims. Let's see, the one good thing I've is that you see a man keep it to Yep, in a much wider light than maybe some would want to. Like, yeah, it's, it's not, it's not glamorous, it's not fun, it's just, it's awful. It's awful that it happened, and if anything, yeah, it's a good thing that, to show like, hey, men are not emotionless machines or whatever. Abuse does happen to them. It's like a, something that a lot of people know but don't want to talk about. So it's good in that regard. Let's see. Uh, all the moving roles we went through. Hope he can at least stand and know he's in light, he's a light and dark for many short. Exactly. Yeah. That's a very that's a very eloquent way of putting it. But there are women who make fake acts so there should be proof to protect him from abuse. Like, yes, make it be for Like, a lot of things are very sided towards women, and in a lot of cases that's a good thing. But in a lot of other cases it's horrible because yeah, it can lead to. Have I said fuck this enemy yet? I don't even know if I'm gonna get a chance to heal. Just this flaily motherfucker. Just f fuck this thing. Thing hits like a truck. Okay, got at least a hit in. 
hits like a truck, has a shit ton of abilities, is flaily as shit. I don't know what this gas does, and I don't like it. Fuck you. Thank you. But yeah, hope, hopefully it sheds a light on that because you, you guys are right when you... I do believe you guys are right when... I'm trying to think of the best way to say this. By creating a situation that has fake accusations in order to profit yourself and, and to hurt someone else just to get what you want out of the deal, it really is taking away from those who are genuinely in that situation. Who are genuinely, like, sexually assaulted or whatever. Because now all... Oh, shit. Now people... It's tainted by the knowledge that there are those that are willing to lie about. So it robs them as well as robs the situation you're in. Yep. So. I, I think the way you guys are putting that. I want to point out. Oh. OS stream. Where, where the fuck am I? Who am I helping? The way you guys put that I think is very good. Like. Or. Er, that makes it sound like I approve your opinion. You put it very well, is what I'm trying to say, if I could talk straight. Real talk, Joe, but is there anything else in this castle? <laughs> I think we're ready to leave the castle. And then, yeah, like it, it also sheds a light on, I guess, I, I can't really call it toxic masculinity, but like different ways that men are treated culturally that is inherently a problem when it's like it's seen as weak to speak up about that kind of stuff it's not good abuse is not good no matter the oh hey i did it recusant sus defeated i did it i couldn't even figure out how to get in Elon Musk buying Twitter is a good thing for free speech, but everyone at least the left wing are going apeshit about it. Man, we are hopping all sorts of different political things, aren't we? Honestly, I'm... I'm totally cool with it. Like, making free speech and equal for everyone? Fuck yeah. Awesome. Golly, I hope Trump comes back to Twitter. If nothing else, just to see people light on fire. It's funny for that reason and that reason alone. <laughs> Because honestly, like, he he was removed from Twitter for his mean tweets. Like, like, that's something I've never understood about, like, people so scared of, like, if someone's on Twitter or, or is not, right? You know, you don't have to follow them, right? If you don't want to see their tweets, you block them. And then, don't look them up. Done. Yeah. I feel like left and right has gone so far in both directions, distracting from us forgetting it. It's been done. So, there's actually, speak of Elon Musk, there's this picture that I saw that I think, like, really perfectly summed it up. I'm going to see if I can find it. I'm going to see if I can find it in 10 seconds. Okay, you ready? This is something Elon tweeted at one point. Oops. No. Fuck off. Okay, there. Chat program, he's following. Shush. This is something I think kind of summarized it up. In a lot of different ways. This is like going way far left and like the center. And it's like yeah, sure, obviously there are people that like go farther this way too. But I think this is just still a really nice way to put it. But anyways. I think I made the joke. I don't think I made the joke on... What the fuck is that? I don't think I made the joke on Twitch. But I've made it to friends, so I'll make it now. If Twitter becomes the equivalent of Call of Duty voice... Like, um... Voice chat rooms, whatever you want to call them. I'm 100% okay with it. <laughs> Just 
free, free for all, horrible, whatever, I am totally down for it, cause fuck it now. <laughs> Max, you need, you need me to run for president? Want me to run for president? Oh, I, I would start, a, I would start fights. Probably not in a good way. <laughs> I, I, we could all dream about what we, you know, what we do for president, what we do as president. I don't know if I'd be a good president. If nothing else, I would run out of patience for a lot of things very quickly. You know what I mean? And a lot of people would probably be like, ah, oh, he's... Who the fuck? Oh, I see it. Perfect. All right. They would have fire fired at me. There. Yeah, I, I would run out of patience with a lot of different things, and I would probably enact a bunch of... There would be... If I was president, there would be a lot of me walking around and seeing different stuff that's like part of our system pointing at it saying and why though or sorry saying but why though and then probably getting in trouble for questioning it like if i just started going down the line right now there might be some things that you guys are like yeah it's probably a good idea but there's probably gonna be other things that you're like what the fuck you know what i mean I like to bring up, we used to have more parties represent our system. It's very interesting about private funding interest is pri God, uh, private funding interest. We've had, what, two presidents get impeached since the night and they still, and they were still seeing off doing the job. What does impeaching even do? <laughs> You'd think impeachment would completely remove you from those offices and such and well, see, the other thing is, like, okay, let's take Obama, right? So, obviously, he wasn't impeached, but, you know, he still runs around and does a lot of talking, does a lot of things, and people probably treat him with the same weight as if he still is the president in a lot of cases, or at least treat him with that same level of, like, respect for the position he had, also because Biden's a puppet. But, you know, it's kind of, it's interesting to think about. Who got impeached in the past <laughs> That's actually another interesting discussion of should your president be a playboy? <laughs> Cause some people are like warlord style. Like, ah, the you know, the ruler of my kingdom has sex with a lot of different women. Alright. You know, some people care, some people don't. That's another discussion. Nope. Oh, shoot. I know. I'm I'm blanking on examples, but I'm willing to bet. If I was president, I would get in trouble. Just because I'd start pointing at things and being like, why this? Why that? Why do I tolerate this? Why do I have to deal with this? Why is so much money being used here? This shit is wasteful. Why is every government whatever specifically designed to waste money and do things in the most inefficient way possible? Why is the government in charge of X, Y, Z? get rid of that shit. There'd be a lot of me pointing at things and saying, get rid of that shit. And I'm an idiot. Like, I'm not going to pretend to know everything. I'd probably do it wrong and people would get mad at me, but eh, whatever. Where the heck am I going right now? Okay. I'm scared all of a sudden. That worked out. Let's see... Sniff's finger. <laughs> Granted, Monica got shafted all puns intended in critical crackers. Uh. Has that a present not actually been removed from us and over? Like, fully removed, removed? Wasn't Phil? I. I'm not the right person to ask about that. I would defer to my mom or dad, who are much better at keeping numbers of historical events in their heads than like. I I could I couldn't say specifically because I'd probably get it wrong. You know what I mean? 
Like a straight up, we are now 100% removing you from all presidential powers. When was the last time that truly happened? I don't know. Hey, you know, like, like I said before, it's all about that learning, right? Uh, did I do this? Have I played up there? I probably have. All right, let's go back to that jail. Does anyone know what the fuck I'm doing in this game? By the way. These hands. <laughs> I'm just walking around. It's like, what am I doing here? <laughs> All right. First step, we get our money back. Yep. Okay. First step, we get our money back. Second step, let's go to the jail. But, um... Yeah, that's, that's not something I'm as knowledgeable on, specifically. I do think it is an interesting discussion, though, of, like, you know, to a certain extent, people are like, oh, my goodness, how dare you? But let, let's make up a situation, right? Let's say someone's president, and they have a lot of prostitutes, and they have a lot of whatever, and they have a lot of sex, and they have a lot of, blah, blah, you know, insert whatever, right? But it's all consensual, none of it's rapey. How much do I bet there'd be a good amount of people who would look at that and be like, oh. <laughs> like, they just wouldn't care. You know, I, I don't know. In, in my head, that's just kind of a... I can't help but look at that and be like, I wonder. You know what I mean? Where? How did I get up there last time? Yeah, you know, imagine a lot of people would be like, yo, the president needs to be up there. The president needs to be the best of us. They need to be the moral com uh, compass. They need to represent all that is good in the American dream. And yeah, I'm willing to bet there'd be a lot of people that'd be like, fuck yeah, president goes out, parties, whoop whoop. That's neither here nor there. This is conjecture that I think is funny in my head. It probably isn't funny. Oop, oop, oop. Okay, so I don't know why I died of fall damage there, but I did. So we're just going to very kindly take this path right back down. Let's see. Max, how would you stop Putin without the risk of starting nuclear war? I think a few other ones were considered. Uh, uh, well, I mean, Trump, obviously, but those were for bullshit reasons. But, um, I gotcha. Max, how would I stop Putin without the risk of starting nuclear war? How would I stop Putin? Well, okay, so... I have to... I have to... I have to I have to remember all the factors and things I learned and like the ten seconds of research I did and Okay. Okay. So first we have to look at why it started. That's the first thing we have to look at. We have to look at the why. And I know there's different reasons, but let's just talk generally, right? We're 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 talking this is us spitballing. None of us are experts here. Unless you are. In which case, why did you ask the question? But All right, so, and if I say anything wrong, please correct me. So the whole reason the whole Ukraine situation started, I forget if it was Russia was invading Ukraine because there's their low key power. Oh, shit. It's good to see you again. Okay, you are not who I was expecting here. You were not who I was expecting. But, um, okay, so the whole... The whole Russia thing was they were doing a low-key invasion. And, oh, look, there's a bunch of immigrants that all happen to be military-aged single men coming into this country. And isn't that convenient and stuff, right? But it really escalated 
when Ukraine wanted to do something about it. Do you hear that laughing? Oh, that's great. And also when they considered joining NATO, right? So it escalated because Russia saw it as a threat that a country would join NATO right beside it. Effectively the Cuban Missile Crisis, right? If I'm, if I'm remembering the true instigation of it correctly. Well, I lucked out there. I only healed once. I feel pretty nice. I feel I feel pretty good about that what I just did right there. Uh by one vote. Jeez. I feel pretty nasty about what just occurred. Good shit. Alright, so that clears out that, that clears out that. So now we can probably teleport there and move on. Ah me, me. Aren't you so special? I give shit. Um, but like, I forget. Oh, hoist medallion. Yeah, sure. Hoist medic. All right. But right, so that's like the whole reason for it and everything, right? That on one side. Putin wants to take land, take power, take more resources, and the like, and Ukraine's just sitting there. You know, it's he's sitting there and he wants it, right? And then by them considering joining NATO, which has been questionable as shit for some time, they are feeling threatened and they're pushing against it. The first part of the mission for is automatically forced to two things to the Guilty. Oh. I appreciate the systems there, though. Okay, so with that idea of, like, Russia doing that, in my opinion, and you can call me, and actually, I shouldn't say you can call me, it's just, in the worlds of, like, in the worlds of first instincts, right? Like, I could be wrong. I like being, or I shouldn't say I like being proved wrong. No one likes to be proved wrong. But like, you know, me acknowledging if I get something wrong, I should be told. Right? That's, that's more what I mean. Um, should I take on these bastards? Oh, look at his health chunk down. Okay, one down. So, right, that, those are the concerns, those are the thought processes, right? So, the first question I would want to ask is in regards of NATO. Hasn't America been, like, mostly funding NATO for some time and other people aren't? Wasn't that a big thing with Trump? That, like, Trump was just trying to get people to pay their fair share. So, to a certain extent, it's kind of selfish, but, like... I really do get the mindset of we're not going to help if no one else pays their fair share because it's no longer a team effort. It's more of just America. So I kind of get that perspective of just like, if y'all aren't going to help the cause, then screw you. You're on your own. There's also a certain amount of Ukraine, like... Hey, you're not part of NATO, but now you're asking for NATO's help, so you essentially don't have the... You're essentially getting the bennies without actually working towards it like the rest of us have. So there's a certain amount of my brain that's like, A, everyone that's part of NATO needs to pay their fair share or we're out. B, is it really fair for a country to be like, no, no, now I'm part of NATO once they feel like they're in danger. It's not the thought process. 
But in terms of actual, like... Oops, shit. I want to jump off. But in terms of, like, actual... You have to deal with Russia. How, how do you do so? I'm not a fan of... What's the term? Proxy wars? Of, like... Let's see. Probably it. That's right. I forgot about that. That is right. I forgot about that. That's a big part of it. All right. So that's just me talking NATO stuff. But like, like, oh, they're praying. I'm not gonna mess with them. They're praying. Let's see. Uh. Which turned out to be true. But um. Right, so with that detail, thank you for reminding me, Redress, that I completely forgot about, right? If there's an agreement that we're going to protect them from Russia... Oh, God, you're... Oh, God. Oh, God. They are looking for any excuse that they could get. But, um... Okay. Oops. There, got one. But, okay, so... In the world of, like... We agreed to protect them. And now they're under threat, so therefore we need to do it. My first thought is, alright, we agreed to it, we're doing it. So... I feel like in a lot of ways, okay, so right now there's like trade sanctions and people are talking, uh, people are talking, uh, airspace protection, right? Like capital rights, full of shit. Anyways. But, um. Damn it, I keep losing my train of thought. It doesn't help that it's getting late. But, um, my first instinct is, my first instinct is, if I say I'm going to protect my friend, I'm going to protect my friend. And right now there's trade sanctions and stuff, but as we've seen in World War II and World War I, economic factors can be a major, can be a major thing and people start major thing. Yeah, that's good. That's good vocabulary you got going there. back. There, okay. Um, what am I trying to say? Economic factors and being felt like they're put into a corner is a big reason people start a lot of wars. So by so by putting Russia into that situation, also by effectively saying no balls, you're kind of pushing him into war. And no one really wants to start any specific kind of punishment for him because we are starting a nuclear war. Ah. It's all good, but hey, jail, border, uh, jail, border, Red Rose, I really do appreciate having you guys here. I guess we could stop on the political discussions then. But uh, thanks so much for being here, guys. I really appreciate having you. I recognize it's, it's about 11 o'clock for me. I need to go to bed as well, so... Let me go just a little bit long. Uh, we already did that path. We'll explore a little bit and then we'll call it a stream. Um, yeah, th thank you all so much for coming. I really do appreciate it. Uh, Friday is... It's still 9 years, still West Coast, not for too long. Um, Friday is 11 to 12-ish. Like somewhere in there I'll start... And then to 5 p.m. CST. So you're six hours ahead. So for you, that will be starting roughly 5, p 5 p.m. to 6 p.m. Going until midnight. Yeah. There you go. And it'll be Elden Ring. We'll be playing more Elden Ring. Yeah, thanks so much for coming, both y'all. Yeah, me and Jail, we both work at 6 a.m. <laughs> Have a good night, man.
I do want to finish the final thought, though. I just have to remember where my thought was. Okay, so... Big economic... You know, okay, so limiting a country economically and essentially looking at their leader and saying no balls is not a good combination because it strikes me, you know, I'm, I'm not going to pretend to know Putin on like a personal level. I'm not going to pretend to know his profile. I'm not going to pretend to know like exactly how his mind works. But let's talk in generalities. If he's war hungry, crazed, insane, just whatever for himself and is just like some horrible, horrible person, right? Someone with their finger on the trigger, looking to start shit. Yeah. Thanks for coming, Jabba. But, um, if someone is just looking, like just effectively, right? Looking to start shit. Right, like we, we can look at economic reasons. You know, religion's the biggest reason people go to war, blah, blah, blah. No, religion's many times used as an excuse. It's resources, okay? It's resources and land. The resources, land, profit. But, um... You know, if someone is crazed and power-hungry, forcing them into a corner, telling them... Yeah, it's true. Ooh, shit, what is that? Forcing them into a corner, looking at them and saying no balls is not a good way to do it. Instead, you just have to be quick and firm. What? Oh, God! Wait, I fought one of you guys before. That makes sense, at least. Shit. In the butt. Okay, we... I don't know where these other... Uh, why are the skeletals saying... Uh, please stop that. Oh, God. Yeah, force them into a corner like that isn't a good idea. Oh, so you're saying to placate them. Not in the slightest, no. Anything like, oh, just give them some land so that they'll calm down. No, that's perpetuating the problem. I'm very much against that as well. I think it's just a matter of... I think it comes down to just... Taking a stand of, like, we said we're gonna protect... Did his tail just go into his butt? Being willing to pre protect Ukraine like we said we would need to. Putting our foot down militarily. And recognizing that Russia kind of forced our hand a little bit. Hiding. Ah, damn it. Yep. Yep. These inflated prices, we have plenty of other sources, to be honest. Yeah. Huh. Alright. If NATO can actually pull their shit and everyone pays for it and everything, then that's all well and good. But, um... I'd have thought that I lost it. Shit. Okay. Wow. That is rough. That was rough. All right. But yeah, like in my mind. Oh, but Max, it could start World War or whatever, and Ukraine itself isn't necessarily that good of a government, and they got corruption, all sorts of other shit going on. Fair. But if you agree to do something, then you need to do it. That That is my thought process. That is how my brain works in that regard. So it would just be a matter of putting, the, putting our foot down, looking at... Putin saying, is this really what you want to do? Do you realize you're really going to start this? Instead of doing proxy war nonsense, either... I recognize because of the threat of nukes and everything, war in a lot of cases is now considered incredibly distasteful. And it should be. War is hell. There's no getting around that. The loss of life in that regards is awful. 
But in my mind, we agreed to it. We agreed to protect them. So therefore, we should agree to protect them. Instead of doing proxy war, maybe I'm, maybe we're helping, maybe we're not. We're gonna send them $33 billion or whatever the number is. Damn. We're gonna send them $33 billion, then spend however many trillion on COVID. You know what I mean? No, no, that's completely true. It's an unfortunate truth. Whoa. Cool, cool, cool. I got a bunch of shit for it. All right, cool. But, um. What was I saying? Let's see. Uh, let's see. It might be corrupt when over four plus million people have to flee their daily lives and struggle. I find it hard to see why anyone could agree with what's going on. Let's be honest, there's corruption in some extent. Yeah, it's true. Doesn't mean they can't do good things, but yeah. So, I reckon, like, okay. This isn't Max saying, haha, warmongering, I want to hit the nuke button. No, war should be avoided if at all possible. But there really is a certain amount of, you need to put your foot down. And here's the deal, if we do have to do some kind of combat, some kind of, like, war, right? It cannot be a half measure. Never. It can never, oh shit, I forgot about that. It can never be a half measure. It has to be either all in or all out. So that is what I would say for, you know, Max for president, right? That is what I would say for Ukraine. Like, you honor the agreement. They honor their side of the agreement. Go in, fix the problem, stop it. Instead of, like, doing side stuff, doing whatever, doing... Da, 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 da. Oh, does that mean you'd vassalize Ukraine? Maybe? I don't know. I don't know how the exact politics of that works. And then, yeah, just... Uh, with the with the oil thing, I am of the opinion that every country should be 100% self-sufficient. I can take a step back and recognize that it isn't always possible, but absolutely everything should be done to the best of every country's ability to be self-sufficient. Because at the end of the day, you know, if we get most of our oil from Russia, and then Russia turns bad, well, then you're kind of fucked. You have to bend to their will. And that sucks. So, yeah, like, a lot of people are like, oh my goodness, Russia's bad. I hear a bug. Oh my goodness, Russia's bad. But then by everyone pulling out oil from all that, they're destroying their economy and making Russia have to double down and da da da. You would have China and Russia for what's looking at us a lot harder. Yeah, exactly, in India, which is where a lot of our pharmaceuticals are made. Yeah. The main reason I said Vassal was thinking more hammer thoughts, not gonna lie. You're you're right though, like for a country to suddenly be like, I own this country I own this country now. Probably not the best decision. That's fair, I'll accept that. There'd have to be, depending on how you would have to protect them though, there might be a certain amount of that, not in name, but in practice, just on the grounds of like, us being in charge of their security for a while and they can build up their own security. I'd probably say that, that's probably not true actually. But it, it is my personal opinion, ah damn it, that, Every country should be self-sufficient. Is trade good? Yes. Is like is like every country created equally when it comes to Damn. Is every country created equally when it comes to resources? That they have absolutely available everything available to them? No, but like I said, to the Damn it. To the best of our abilities. So to have all of our oil only come from one source and then to have that source be hateful or to be like antagonistic towards you it's not a good look not a good look at all 
I got a little lucky there. So yeah, everyone immediately demonizing Russia, them not doing the invasion very well on their own anyway, and then everyone like screaming with him in that regards. Eh, it's not gonna be good. Nope. Oh, another cave. This cave might actually be a good place to stop if we can finish it quick enough. Yep. There you go. Let's see, we could drill into the Rockies, our last bit of fuck with wildlife and protect the forest. <sighs> Honestly, if we don't reverse some of our ways, other protections won't matter in a few decades. Oh, sorry, I keep hitting the microphone. Perfumer's Grotto. Oh, good. Um. Yeah, just the way things are going, like. Sorry, something that something that will forever drive me nuts is people who will like virtue signal and like rain on everything America, American made, and then it's like, oh, you know, let's just take let's just take oil, for example, having to get it from the Middle East and from different countries that like people will virtue signal about like women's rights and all sorts of stuff, right? Yet the place we buy oil from might not let women drive cars. Just to use an extreme example that I'm probably saying offhandedly. Yeah. Like, I, I think, if possible, any technology that could be... Oh, jeez. Any technology that could be... De this is so copy... No, maybe not. Any technology that could be done to make it so it doesn't fuck over the environment as much as possible... You know, would be good. Obviously, is how possible is it? I don't know. But efforts to be made, right? Obviously, I don't want the entire environment to be destroyed, but if it puts us in a situation where our, where the lives of the lives of my countrymen are in danger because of it, and we have to rely on someone who ultimately does not have our best interests in mind, and to give them money to fuel them into what is possibly efforts for them, or to fuel people who would want to hurt us. Then I wouldn't want to do it. Not uh, any other one to do versus our poor China smaller. We have polluted for a long period, but they have polluted much harder than the time they've been able to. To be fair, tired the USA did it first, so we need time to do it to grow. <sighs> yeah, that's the other thing that's kind of along the same thought process of like America is the root of all evil, and they're pollution, they're polluting, and it's all awful and bad. Yeah, sure, we'll still do whatever with these countries that are ten times worse, and it's fine. Ah, uh, we're gonna... We're gonna ruin people's lives in the name of slavery and reparations in the past, and blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Heck yeah, we'll still do stuff from China that has literal, like, that has literal slavery in Uyghur camps. Yeah, I don't see a problem with it. It's like hypocrisy. It's just absolute hypocrisy. So, you know, in my mind, it's like, okay, so if these are the moral standards we have, then we shouldn't deal with these countries that have those things. That or you should at least be more consistent about it. Yeah. Try the U.S. did it first, so we need our time to do it to you. The Great Barrier of Austria is being looked at for removal, looking for removal protection right now because 60% is dead. Yeah. Which is awful. Like, Max doesn't care about the environment. No, I do. Oh. Oh, this is really bad. No, Max doesn't care about the environment. No, Max does care about the environment. But keeping in mind the safety of your people and what is reasonable to do and when... Sorry, I'm losing the ability to think of words. To say words well. Okay, is green energy, is technology to help with the coral reefs, is anti-pollution stuff good? Yes. Should it be encouraged? Yes. 
But a lot of stuff when it comes to environmentalism is not so much used as... Or isn't focused on actually helping the environment so much as being used as a cudgel over people's lives and a ways to control people's lives. That's where my concern kicks in. Right, exactly. Yeah, we're down the plane, we're on past the point. And then also it's like, okay, so America... America is responsible for X amount of pollution because we live in America. That's where we're going to push the hardest. This place is huge. Try tunnel and then not here. Huh. I get that. But if people want to be truly consistent about that kind of stuff, then they also need to be looking to other countries that are doing things way worse than we are and you know fighting how they can for that yeah that's that's my that's my main poorly articulated point in that regard you know and then like you look at the amount of pollution that America does cause and you're like oh let's see Versus like other countries and then it's like well we have to get America as low as possible right but why aren't you fighting to help those other countries with that issue and da, 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 da. cuz yeah like this isn't me advocating the death of all natural life for my convenience but there is a certain amount of having to get the rest of the world on board because we can only do so much. Individuals can only do so much. Heck, even only one country can only do so much. I, I don't know what the situation is here. So, I just remembered that the mimic makes you lose health. Bum, 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 bum. Okay. Yep. <sighs> Great omen killer cleaver. Nice. Good job, Mimi. Anyways, I'm sorry, Redress. I apologize. My brain is shutting down at a high rate of speed. <laughs> My brain is absolutely shutting down. Ah. Uh, did I articulate well? I hope I did. I hope I didn't say anything stupid or token. Oh god, that's a lot of text. Let's see. Uh, I don't really agree with the only so many per kids version. But at the same time, I sort of like the flora and fauna of this plan. Maybe we should consider a little more strength and increase our specimen numbers beyond the point of the group now. Well. Alright, Thanos. How, how do I best address that state? Because I can understand what you're thinking when you say that. I understand the thought process. And me not thinking very hard, there's a few ways we can address that. Because, okay, that's a genuine concern. You know. Like. There's a few different ways to solve that problem, and I don't think the first way to do it is to just declare no more babies. So I think a lot of it does come down to proper ways to aggregate things, Ag to have agriculture in areas so that we can provide more food, make areas more livable, not destroy the environment, have more trees so that way it keeps things together, doesn't turn them into a desert, making use of lands that are normally in inhospitable. Um, Encouraging farms that are able to produce more yields so that they can feed more people. Different countries and the way that they manage their cities and towns and everything. Not letting them turn into slums, but actually letting them grow. That's a difficult... Making sure you're actually using your resources all as well, but also recognize that a lot of the technology that people consider eco-friendly, like wind and solar, isn't quite up to par that we can fully convert everything over to it. So that what we do do with oil and stuff, we have to make sure is like done in the most efficient and least wasteful way possible. In general, just making it so we're not wasteful. That's a big thing. 
we just don't think ahead and fight too much among ourselves. I mean, a lot of it just comes down to power. Like, yeah, actually, yeah, I can I can say that in good faith. A lot of it just comes down to power and people not wanting to give things up and people not wanting to cooperate or people just only looking out for themselves and not really thinking about the future. And da, 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 da. Max, you're no better than that. Yeah, probably you got me there. Actually, let's do that first. Okay, so here's what we'll do next time. But rip nuclear. <sighs> yeah, that that's a big thing too. Like people have a really bad stigma against nuclear energy, but nuclear energy is great for a lot of reasons, but a lot of people really don't like it. And da, 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 da. Making that technology widespread. And I, I, I guess my thought process on that is I don't think I don't think it's necessarily that the world is too overpopulated. We just need to kill half of everyone and I just wish a plague would happen and murder everyone. I'm not that kind of a person. But I think there is a lot to be said for more wisely utilizing the resources that more wisely utilizing the resources that are present and making better use of the space and like working on different parts of the environment or different areas to make them so they are hospitable essentially taking a geck from fallout and making it work kind of deal it's not we could have 20 billion people we took care of and nature would be fine yeah that's not me saying like all oh, the trees should burn so blah 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 no there's there's a balance it's hard it's debatable but there is a balance I see nothing wrong with that kind of a thought process. Let's mark for what we're gonna. Do. Millicent is still there. Okay, so we're here. So we're gonna go. We're gonna do this shit. And then we'll be here. Yeah, we'll go here. So okay, so there's a thing on the bridge. There's a thing on the bridge. And there's that. And that. And that. So we'll do that, and then we'll move out, and we'll. Okay, so what all what all did we do opposite? Well we we cleared we cleared the rest of this. Yeah, we did we did all this and there's a lot of dungeons and there's a lot of stuff in it, and then we started moving around over here. Oh then we did all the sewer which turned into a huge hole area. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, next time we'll move to do this shit. And then we'll do this inner shit. And then from there, we take the plunge, go to the rolled road, the rolled route, and move on to the mountains. Yeah. <sighs> Let's see. Uh, if I don't see us as a collective species getting to that, I may be wrong though. We'll see in theory. I mean, best thing you can do is hope for the best, work on what you can control, and encourage and vote for the technologies that can help better to do those other things that you want to do, right? I mean, on one side, obviously, should you be conscientious of the future? Yes. Should you be ripping your hair out at this current moment? No. I know it's like, well, duh, but I think it's a... It's a thing I definitely need to remind myself a lot. So I don't think it's a bad thing to say. Or I'm an asshole. I can accept, I can, I can accept my life if I'm, oh, something else I want to check real quick. I can, I can accept my life decisions if I'm an asshole. Um. Raises charge attack power. Uh, oh, okay. Okay, cool. Um. Boost guardian ability. We got a few of these things. I didn't actually look to see what they did. <laughs> um. We'll probably stick with what we got now. I'm going to flip back to the, uh, uh, okay, um, no, nah, I think, I think we're good, I think we're good on spells, yeah, yeah, we're good there, there's something else I was going to, there we go, there we go. Probably. Okay, so blood slash. I imagine it's the same as. Yeah, 
Yeah, so it'd basically just be a wave of blood. So it'd be the same logic if we want to. I'd probably do this one. No, actually, I'd probably... Max, how present is your brain? <laughs> Alright, um... Fuck it, let's go back to this one. We'll, we'll have that one for next time. And then... See. Uh, quick max how melty is your brain oh it's getting there oh it's getting there believe you me my brain is pretty damn melted right now hold on um let me let me let me do this while it's in my head max i don't think now's the time to do this let me do this while it's in my head. Big meaning. <laughs> hold on, oh, okay, hold on. I have faith text will fix in the future. It might not be in my lifetime though, which I can accept. I totally get that you can't do anything or hold it all in your shoulders for sure. Just bummer because I feel bad for Jerry. She's coming after me and I have a hard time working with Lulu. But if you'd like to see me have left this fix for the rest of my story, I'm gonna I can't get touch on purpose. I mean, I think, that, I think that's a big aspect of it. Like, recognize what you can or can't control. And if nothing else, if you can impart that mindset onto others, not in like a culty, forcey way, but in like a holy shit, I almost got my skele my skele boys fully upgraded. F fuck yeah! But um, just the ability to inspire them to be able to do those things, I think, is in its own right incredibly valuable so there's nothing i would say there's hey my guard boost did go up i would say there's nothing wrong with like nothing wrong with that i think that's still a good and noble thing to oh look it's slightly better by two points i think it's a good thing to want to inspire those for the future there's nothing wrong with that Ooh. All right, upgraded my shield, upgraded that. So yes, next time. Yeah. Next time we start here, clear that, and then finish up the rest of Altus Plateau. I, th I think I went off on a tangent longer than you. No, 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 there's nothing wrong with the tangent you went on. I want you to know that my brain is just fucking melting. <laughs> you definitely get some sleep max, it's 12.30 for you, yeah? Uh, it is 11.30 for me, but I have to wake up for work in five and a half hours. I'm not allowed to show up drunk again, because last time they threw a fit. Oh, God, tomorrow I'm going to have to go around to every computer. Oh, I just remembered something I had to do tomorrow at work. The... It'll be fine. <laughs> Panning me for my own shit. <laughs> no, no, we we really do need to end the episode. But I, I will say thanks for hanging out, man, and stick around for big, long, political, philosophical thing. I know this isn't everyone's shtick. I hope I didn't drive too many people away, but I appreciate you hanging around and giving thoughtful conversation for it. I just hope I was able to give some form of thought process that was worthy of it as well, and not just repeating things that other people said or, um... Not, you know, not formulating your own opinions, but just parodying or just, like, giving useful, useless advice. That That's my hope. I just want to encourage critical thought and, like, yeah. But, um, yeah. Let's end the episode off here. Next time we stream is going to be on Friday, roughly 11 to 12, uh, 11 to 12, or 11 a.m. to 12 p.m.-ish CST to 5. We're going to be back to Elden Ring. Like I said, this game has been... Like I said, this game is awesome and I love it, but we do need to move on to other things like Metal Gear Rise of the So that will be on Friday. And then after that, on Monday, we'll be back to the Resident... We will actually finish the Resident Evil 2 remake DLC. So we're going to be starting the Resident Evil 3 remake, which I'm really excited about. I think it's going to be a lot of fun, even though I heard it was shorter and a lot of people weren't happy with it. I think it's still a good time. I just realized I haven't really been thinking about the things I've been saying for quite some time. Golly, it's been a stream of consciousness. Woof. 
Um, and also switch on Facebook, Twitter, and Discord because I suck at social media. The VOD will be put on YouTube relatively quickly. I think that's everything. Yeah. Let's end the episode off here before I puke. Um, Red Rose, once again, thanks so much for hanging out and everyone lurking. I hope y'all had fun with our silly conversations. But let's end the episode off here. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope y'all had fun. I know I did. And I will see you then. Oop, oop, come on, come on. There you go. Thank you for coming. Bye.